Thank you, Rotri. What's up, Omen? Gustavo, what's up, man? We're gonna clap those cheeks tonight. 20 people in the chat and no one's talking. Come on, guys. Say hello and clap that like button. Hey. Thank you, Mike. I appreciate that. What's up, Foul Evo? How you doing? The Batman colors. Yes. Sitting in the Batman chair. You, can see the, you can't really see the Batman logo. The lighting is not directed at the chair like that. Letting that beard grow. Hey, it's looking a little bit... Hey, it's looking a little bit darker, right? Yeah. Yeah. Get our, get our uh, Viking on right now. Daniel, what's up, man? Hope you guys are all having a great week so far. How's my day going? My day went phenomenal, Dan. Thank you so much. I got a lot done. Uh, one thing about me, when it comes to doing laundry, <laughs> I uh, I never fold my clothes after. And it just gets to a point where, like, okay, we're basically... I'm not even using my drawers anymore. I'm actually just, like, taking my clothes out of the laundry basket. Clean. I have clean clothes in the laundry basket, dirty clothes on the floor, and I'm just living out of the laundry basket, and I hate that. So today I took my time and uh, emptied that entire laundry basket, folded as much as I could, washed the dirty ones, folded some of those, and uh, gonna work on the rest of it tomorrow, so hopefully that'll be the case. Saran, so you can touch my skunt anytime you want. What's up, man? Laundry, just buy new clothes. <laughs> Let's get it. That's fine, we are in quarantine. <laughs> Yep, yep. So I didn't really get a chance to actually like work on any videos today. Just uh, just been enjoying myself, having a good time. It's been a long time as well, Saran. I see that. You gotta come by and leak your nudes, man. When can we smash, bros? You know what? Actually, Steve, Minecraft Steve came out last night. I think we could definitely smash soon. Do I like Zombieland? Which one's Zombieland? Is that the movie with um, Woody Harrelson? Woody Harrelson, uh, Emma Stone, Jesse Eisenberg, right? Is that Zombieland? Make sure it's hand clean before you touch your skunt. <laughs> What's up, Kev? <laughs> God bless you. Need to play some Smash. I've been lacking lately. Jesse Eisenberg, yes. Just crashed. I'm back. What's up, Flea? Welcome back. Yeah, I do like that movie. I didn't watch Part 2 yet, right? Part 2 came out last year. I didn't watch that one. So I'm doing the hardest part of Parasite Eve. Yes! The hardest and the most uh, mentally draining part of Parasite Eve. It's the Chrysler Tower. Boot it up so we get some background noise going because our song just finished. Parasito Evo. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a sec, wait a sec, wait a sec, wait a sec. Wait a sec. Which one is the one? There's two. Ah, there we go. Okay. I did have one open already. Ha <laughs> ha! I'm crazy! And I'm back! Kev! What's going on, man? I'm over here finishing up Parasite Eve. I don't know if you're still in the chat or not right now. For those of you guys that don't know, Kevin in the chat is uh, my older cousin. The one I tell you guys about all the time that put me onto these amazing games that we've been playing on stream. Uh, obviously, the trifecta. He put me onto Metal Gear Solid, Final Fantasy VII, and what we are playing right now, Parasite Eve. So it's, a ple it's an honor to have you here, my dude. The people here love you, because without you, there's no me. Kept missing all your Parasite Eve runs. Finally caught one. Hey. <laughs> That's awesome, Flea. Happy to have you here, man. Cousin's got great taste in games. Yes, he does. Yes, yes, the hardest parts. So we did already. We already completed the museum. Fought the gigantic T Rex. I did that off stream because we already did it previously on stream. All we have left to do is just pretty much just go through the Chrysler building. But 
Just because I'm kind of close to leveling up, I think we're going to run back to the museum. Do some levels. You know, level up. I want to hit 35 before we do Chrysler Building. I mean, it doesn't matter, but I just want to do it, man. I just want to live. Go to the museum. All love indeed, man. Do, 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 do. Let's see. Hmm. Sorry, I was looking at something. <laughs> Listen to that snow crunch. Resitub, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. If you are here, say what's up in the chat. Bless us with your presence. Gray P, what's up, man? That snow is extra crunchy. Let's see if we can get into some, into some fights. We've only got 30k XP until we hit a max level. Not max level, sorry. We'll level up. But the thing with the Chrysler building, we will level up, but it's going to take forever. Because them enemies in there are pretty soft. What's up, Abby? How you doing? Jeff says, thanks, Jonathan. I taught him everything I know. He has greatly surpassed me. <laughs> we are equals. Oh, God. Why did that do 75? Oh, that one to the right to hit me. Oh, dodge his ass. I'm getting hit by that one. When it KO. Oh my god. The XP you get in this museum is crazy. Insane. Absolutely. We got a lot of items. Let's uh let's free up some space. Use some medicine threes. The trees. What do I think about Dragon Ball Z Kakarot? Uh, I'll be honest with you. I've said it before, but I really didn't like it. You know, I was hoping, you know, honestly, I was thinking the Dragon Ball Z RPG, right? You have so many good games that you can steal from, right? Take the concept of what Boo's Fury was, leg Legacy of Goku 2. They didn't do any of that. <laughs> they didn't do any of that at all. And that was a little disappointing for me. Because I think that, uh, I think Dragon Ball Z Kakarot could have been really good, but I didn't like how it advertised itself as an RPG, and it was the farthest thing from it. Because the game auto-leveled you. It didn't matter what side quests you did. You didn't, you really didn't have to do any side quests. The game auto-leveled you, pretty much carried your, like, you know, it held your hand as you went through the game. I, I personally didn't really like that. Do you think you'll beat it tonight, Blitz? Yes! With enough determination and mental capacity, we can do this together. I'm more than positive we could beat that. What's up, Hugo? How you doing? Parasite Eve has a bomb soundtrack. Yes, it does. I played Parasite Eve 2, and it's still in my memory from 20 years ago. Nice. Oh, that's what you meant years ago. I got you. Oh, we are trying. We're going to do it. That's all we have left to do is the Chrysler building. We did the first 10 floors. We got 60 floors left. I think it'll take us, honestly, probably two to three hours, right? I tried to uh, get some levels going today, but I was just super busy with other stuff that I was trying to see if I can get to a certain point of the Chrysler building. So this way we can just jump on stream, finish up like the last, what, 20 or 30 floors and then move on. And right now, since we beat the T-Rex, the uh, encounter rate inside the museum isn't going to be that high. So we're not really going to get into a lot of fights. I fought the T-Rex because I thought it was going to be enough to put me at 35, but it wasn't. So we got to go back through here and uh, hunt some enemy cheeks down. Thank you guys for the 33 likes already, by the way, guys. Really, really appreciate that. If you haven't yet, hit that like button. Let's try to get to 40. When do you think part two of Final Fantasy VII Remake will come out? I think April 2022. 
feel like it's a safe I feel like it's a safe uh, bet you hit me yeah now it's gonna go far hit him for 20s <laughs> Finger popping each other's assholes. You get a like and she gets a like. Everyone gets a like. What's up, Gino? How you doing, man? Do, 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 do. Oh man, I'm late. I thought you were going to announce that you're live. Hey, what's up, McFever? No worries, man. We literally just got started, so don't worry about that. So I think I'll be able to pay off my mortgage before it releases. <laughs> Damn, shots fired. Oh yeah, that's the, that's the end spot. We can't go there yet. The mechanics back then had some similarities to the Resident Evil franchise, but yeah, I'm digging this one too. So like part two, they designed to be more like Resident Evil, which I didn't really like because I like I like how this one felt. I think that they could have expanded more on this, but they went full on Resident Evil with the tank controls and kind of pretty much the camera angles. You can't even see that motherfucker. I busted his ass. Nori, what's up, man? And I'm glad you are here too, McFever. The hell? Just got an alert saying my NFC may be blocked. I've never seen that before pop up on this phone. Am I being hacked? Are they about to leak my nudes? My nudes are about to be leaked. But I haven't started my OnlyFans yet. Oh God! <laughs> yeah, Parasite 2. I want to beat because I've never done it. I got to the very end. I've heard. I heard where I left off at was at the very end. And when I was younger, I couldn't beat it. But I'm a much more seasoned gamer. I've been marinated. I've been, you know, covered, left in the fridge for about, you know, saying like two hours. The juices have been cooked. It's nice and soaked. So I think my skills to pay the bills are going to be present and we'll be able to destroy Parasite Eve 2. Not Zenut. <laughs> How am I doing? I'm doing great, Nori. Thank you for asking. Yeah, this one has some originality to it. That's maybe why it's so uh, special. I agree, man game is very special we need I think, three more fights three or four more fights will actually like get us over to 35 i want to hit 35 and then we'll move on to the chrysler building and we'll just run through that and we're gonna have a fun night we're just gonna be chilling we're gonna be chatting with everybody we get to everybody uh everybody's questions in the chat <laughs> renee says we are your only fans <laughs> that's funny actually love that you guys got amazing sense of humor david kim what's up man Gamers wore Dello using talk to text while I'm driving, so some things may be lost in translation with my accent. Hey, no worries, man. Drive safe. Happy to keep you happy to be keeping you company. Has Square announced anything about how or if your file from remake part one can be used in remake part two? It... Oh fuck, I wasn't supposed to go through there. It's okay, I don't have to continue. Right? I don't have to I don't have to continue. I could just walk back. Yeah, because I would have to walk up, but I could just walk back now. Yeah, silent fans like me. <laughs> also, can I get a bump up to Jesse Discord? I wasn't sure if that happens with the member chat rank. Hey man, thanks for letting me know. Uh mods, if you guys get a chance, can you please uh change file Evo's tier in Discord to the correct Jesse tier? I'm sorry about that, dude. It doesn't do it automatically. I have to do it manually. Oh, God. I'm getting zapped. Oh, you get to do shit. 
Alright, two of these should be dead. A hey. quick max, quick max. Hey, not a problem, man. Thank you so much for being a member. I really do appreciate that. What's up, Nathan? Kelly, what's up? Are you going to do a Steve video? I would love to do a Steve video. I'm going to see if this... Maybe Saturday, I'm thinking? We could do like a stream where we all play Smash and we just, you know, get to learn the character Steve. Oh, how did I... Oh, I didn't dodge that. I didn't dodge that at all. I got hit. But I'd love to break down Steve because I think he has some cool offstage uh, gameplay and I love characters that have an amazing offstage gameplay. Happy to be a member on your channel. Your taste in games rock. Oh, man. Thank you so much, dude. I appreciate that. Do, 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 do. Oh! He's rolling poly ass niggas. Boom. Come at me, bruh. Yo, we're about to hit it. Aaron, what is up, man? We got so much metagens. Hopefully we get into a fight up here. I haven't been down this hallway in a while. I'm trash, but I'm getting better. Practice makes perfect, gal. That blows that YouTube took down that community post. They're just jelly, I guess. Yes. Yes, they are. How dare they? They're just, uh, you know what? I think it is. I think they're just, um, they're Aerith Sims. They're not Tifa Sims. But they see Tifa, they hit the ban button. I'll be back. Keeps on buffering. No worries, Nori. See you in a few. Can we get a shout out to One Bullet and Jose for helping me with my computer and getting those bricks up in the air? Yes, for real, guys. Thank you guys so much, Jose and One Bullet. That's amazing. Of you guys to do that for McFever. Thankful to have a community that is so cool and caring and giving that you guys would um, come together and put together parts to build another community member a PC. I don't think anybody else's community on YouTube has ever done that, and I'm super thankful for that, guys. And I'm sure McFever is as well, of course. Welcome to PC Master Race. Oh yeah, there's no enemies in this room, ever. Not since the first time you fight people in here. Which is weird. I think two more fights. What am I at, 5k? We're at 5k right now? Yep. 5.6. Yeah, there's no fights in this, uh... This one, too. Go this way. Should be a fight in here. I haven't been here so long. There's no fight. What? What? I have a question for you and the community, if you will allow it. Sure, go ahead, Aaron. Where the enemy cheeks at? Unity! Alright, I haven't been here in a while. This ha there has to be a fight in here. Grasshoppers. Bro! You crazy! The crazy man! Are you watching us on your uh, new PC, McFever? Why am I looking for fights? Uh, I just need, I'm like OCD right now. 
I'm looking for two fights to hit level 35. Just want to hit level 35 and then we'll run to the Chrysler building. Because we're not going to level up in the Chrysler building anytime soon since all the enemies are a little bit lower leveled. Damn! I'm going to shoot this guy. Oh yeah, one more fight. Which female character in the Final Fantasy universe has the most clappable cheeks? I vote Fran from 12. I didn't play 12, so I don't know who Fran is. You guys already know who I'm gonna choose. I already went here. Let me go back the other way. What did I just say? I've never played 12, my guy. Or I mean XII, sorry. Final Fantasy XII. Damn it, dude, so far. Hmm. Does Aerith have cheeks? I'm just so joking. <laughs> Shots of fire. <laughs> I mean, the flower girl will be in the garden all the time, so I could only imagine she'd be hitting them squats. Ding! All right, 35, 35. Hey, we get a lot of BP for hitting 35. Cool. Let me use these right now, actually. And right, we're done. We're done with this place. Let's go to the Chrysler Tower. Yo, 763 HP. Avidy strong. But in the entire universe, I'll go with Miss Lockhart. Lulu's a definite second. Ooh. How come they got rid of, uh, you guys ever wonder sometimes for Remake, why did they get rid of Aerith's, um, MC Hammer pants that she wore in, uh, original? Now my computer is in the family room, which is basically across the house from the router. <laughs> is it, uh, so it's not, so is it wireless or is it wired? Gotta get them things set up, my dude. Maybe get a maybe get an extender. Alright, yeah, we're done with this place. We're just leaving. Wow, what? It's 10k XP to level up next after 35? Jesus Christ. I just saw Dan's question. Does anyone like anime? And Tracy said, no, none of us watch anime ever. <laughs> We love anime, Dan. I'll admit, I don't watch a lot. I watch more of the mainstream anime, like, you know, Dragon Ball, Naruto, Yu Yu Hakusho, Inuyasha, Cowboy Bebop, Samurai Champloo, um, Death Note. Death Note's one of my favorites. But as far as Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh, Pokemon counts. Um, Ham Taro when I was younger. <laughs> Come on, Ham Hams. Bring those cheeks. All right, let's save the game real quick. Weeaboo Nation. Well, J once Josh enters the chat, Josh is our anime connoisseur. That dude knows every anime. Who knows good anime? What's up, Blinding Solo? My dude, it's been a while. Yo, shout out to Blinding Solo. One of the OG subscribers on the channel, man. I hope all is well with you. I haven't heard from you in a while, my guy.
I'm taking you with me as I look for a long enough Ethernet cord. You know, uh, actually, McFever, now that you mention it, Walmart actually started selling 100 foot Ethernet cables, Cat 6s, too. Uh, they're pretty cheap. It was like $18 last I checked. Super affordable. So if you ever get a chance, you just hit up Walmart. Their brand is called Ion, I think it is. I think it's called Ion. The Chrysler Building. Yo, look at this place. I've walked right by this place before. Go to the 11th floor, start clapping some cheeks. Bloop. Ooh, actually, wait, before I do that, let's go back to the, let's go back to NY uh, PD station because I got some trading cards to unlock an extra slot on my weapon. And then we can add burst from the shotgun. I almost forgot about that, guys. Let's get some, let's get some buffs. Let's get some buffs. Yeah, no worries, McFever. I think they have it behind the glass cases now in the electronic section in Walmart. But crazy, because back in the day, man, you used to have to buy, you used to have to spend big money for a, like a 50 foot Ethernet cable. I remember a 50 foot Ethernet cable was like $40 on Amazon, and a 100 foot cable was like 60 something. But now it's like 20 bucks for that? Hell yeah. Bro, I could like leak my nudes and make enough to buy that like within the hour, right? Did anyone like Bleach? Bleach was another one. I stopped watching Bleach very early though. I didn't get really that far into it, but a lot of my friends love Bleach. They think it's like one of the greatest animes of all time. There are 70 floors in the Chrysler building and we're on 11. We got a lot of stuff to drop off to this dude. Let's uh, store some equipment. Put the P2020 in there. Jesus Christ, look how much stuff we got. M8000, because we got that equipped already. Don't need my is gonna ah well it's not gonna let us move it actually. So let's see. Uh I think that's good for that. Let's go to items. So can I move this finally? Oh my god, can I? Yes? You can get rid of this damn key. No, no, you can't. Damn you might uh in your pointless shit. Hey, we got lots of space. Jesus. Digimon. Digimon, I did not watch. I don't know. I couldn't get into Digimon when I was younger. I know Alecky Pito. He's not in the chat right now, but he he's big into Digimon. I think he was telling me he was recently watching. I don't know if it's a new Digimon or like the old school one, but he was watching something about it. Yeah. yeah, I'm just saying Walmart because it's like the easiest, especially if like you're in America, there's a Walmart on like every 10 minutes you drive. So uh, it's definitely a spot. Like if you want to get an Ethernet cable today or now, you can definitely go pick one up. And I say get the 100 foot because you never know. You don't want to buy the 50, run, all the, run it all the way and you don't have enough space. What am I doing? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I got to talk to this dude. Or actually let me I gotta take back a card key from him I forgot trading cards look how many trading cards we got we did that glitch and we got so much trading cards but look at this this is like my it's like my NFL card collection twenty bits add a slot boom there we go we got a slot, so now we can do some magic. Rurouni Kenshin. Watched that when I was younger. And... Do I have any junk? I don't think I have any junk. I do have junk. Favorite anime was actually a movie. Street Fighter 2, the animated movie. Spinning bird kick!
Okay, so looking at this, let's see, spray multiple targets from burst. Burst is the one, right? That's what somebody was telling us to use burst. I feel like I should save before I do this. Let me save just in case. What? Because like, what? What if I don't like it? You know, which I doubt. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like it. But just say, let's just solve the game. All right, let's solve the game. We'll move on. Animes in the early 90s and early 2000s were great. Yo, we got a, almost a full house here tonight, guys. I see everybody's names popping up. Steven Burns, what's going on, my dude? Everybody's showing up tonight, man. It's been a while. Hope you are well. I am very well, man. I hope you are well, too. Thanks for, thanks for checking in with us, man. What you been up to? We've just been playing some more classic games. We're pretty much done with this game, but we're going to go through the new game plus. What was I going to do? Go tune up. I got the D's Newt. Oh, there's no other thing to tune it up with. That's right. Um. Well, I'm going to get better armor, so I'm just going to hold on to this for now. Some of the other better stuff is in storage. All right, let's go change. Let's go put burst on his gun. Let's see what it's like. Game looks crispy, even if it is an older game. Man, thank you, Renee. Got the graphics turned up all the way. High as I can. Butterfly in the sky. Come on! I can fly twice as high. Let's get it on. Ever heard that reading Rainbow DMX remix? You think it's a game? Hey, what am I doing? I don't gotta do anything with this dude. Get out of my face. Uh, yeah. That's what I thought. Let's put, let's put that burst on it. Oh man, let's see what this is gonna be like. It's gonna be crazy. Yeah, reading Rainbow. Look up uh, reading Rainbow DMX remix. <laughs> you like my gun name, Gino? It is technically a pointy bit. Called pointy gat, pointy black black. Damn, forgot I washed my thing. My sweat rag. Wait, what am I doing? I gotta turn on my trusty fan. Guys, whatever you do, invest invest in a crotch fan. Like this? This tiny little crotch fan right here. Invest in one. If you're a man, if you're a female, you need a crotch fan. I'm a firm believer. Glizzy! Play PC anyway, just wanted to just want a PS5 for exclusives, most would be 2021, and so all is good. Yo, we're doing a giveaway. We're doing two giveaways for PS5s coming up very soon. You definitely want to stay tuned for that information whenever it goes live. You got one of those chilling next to your console. Eh? I got one on the floor right here, man. It's hitting my hands and it's hitting my crotch. And I'm telling you right now, I'm feeling kind of crispy. Feeling good. Especially with my Manscaped underwear the best combination i feel like you know what i feel like i feel like i'm sitting on the flying nimbus cloud right now oh god let's go the 10th floor did anyone else like the original power rangers you know i've met uh i've met some of the original power rangers i met uh, the red ranger at supercon and i met the pink ranger at a random bar in Toronto. Sitting on a donut? I actually don't sit on a donut. My donut's over there. Oh, wait. Isn't there supposed to be music playing in here? No. Is it broken? 
Please tell me if we get into a fight, it'll fix the music. Kinda sucks. Can I apply for the giveaway? I live in Scotland, dude. Yes, anybody can. Invest in a gay bulge fan. Oh, this sucks, dude. I really hope the uh the music comes. Took the elevator. Kind of interesting that we're not getting to any encounters on the 10th floor. What is this shit? Right, is that going up or down? I have no idea. Let's see. Son of a bitch. That's why. Fook. All right, I think the best the best thing to do because we went backwards. We went backwards like an idiot. Let's go to the next elevator, go back up to the 10th floor and then go right because we went left. I got to go right. A D's nuts fan. Yes. Really that's cool, man. I thought I had I said I had a pre-order but it was canceled for unknown reason trying to get it reinstated. Hey, man. It's all good. Our first giveaway is going to be channel exclusive merch. You cleared the 10th floor last play. Thank you, Mike. I'm trying to find this damn elevator now. I think it's up here to the right, maybe. The elevator layout on this in this uh, place doesn't make any sense. Gotta take off blitz. I have fun. Yo. All right, Gino. See you around, man. Thanks for dropping by and hanging with us. Instead of going all the stairs like Remake, you gotta keep walking miles and miles in that building. Yes. <laughs> Square Enix was very into making people walk a lot in their games back in the day. Does anyone like Dragon Ball GT? Kind of. It's okay. Ever taking a shit so big it felt kind of gay? Um, pretty sure you have. <laughs> Shout out to Jose. Jose, thanks. I don't know if you guys saw earlier, but I was shouting you and one bullet off for hooking up McFever with those awesome computer parts. And I was thanking my community for being so amazing that they uh, do kind of do cool stuff like that. Miguel, what's up, man? Bro, where the hell is this elevator? Yeah, Super Saiyan 4 was the coolest part about GT. And, uh, you know, Gogito. Go in Super Saiyan 4. Gogito? Gogita. <laughs> Trying to find this goddamn elevator. So I can go back up. It's like, at this point, I should have just went back up the other way. But I felt like the elevator would have been closer. This is going to be a fun segment no my god are we going <sighs> it's building the first giveaway miguel is going to be channel exclusive merch t-shirts so it's going to be a one-of-a-kind design for our channel one person will get it and that person will also get a free video game of their choice playstation xbox pc nintendo switch let me know what it is. It has to be the standard edition, of course. Can't be anything crazy like some ultimate edition of whatever game. 
you know more blitz here in portugal it's 2 a.m in the morning see you peace out man yo hugo have a great night man thank you for hanging out with us and stopping by and saying what's up dude i really appreciate that we'll see you on the next one it's a random pick throughout everybody that uh joined subscribed is a member all that stuff renee one thing I loved about this game is how alone it feels like back in the good Tomb Raider games. It's like your footsteps in the environment. Yo, what is going on with this layout, dude? Why can't I find an elevator? Before we were finding elevators like nothing. Now they're giving us a hard time finding these shits. Alright, I feel like an elevator is coming up. Next screen. Feeling it. Storage door. Whatever, we're just gonna walk it. Have I played Dragon Quest XI? Yes, yes I have. Akira Toriyama drew and designed the characters for the Dragon Quest series. Uh, Dragon Quest VIII, my uh, favorite. I played XI, I didn't beat it. I got to like the Ice Town area in Dragon Quest XI. Still gotta go through and beat that. I would love to play that one on stream. I just don't want to restart it from beginning because I got a lot of stuff unlocked and I would hate to go back and really unlock all of that all over again. I wouldn't mind like playing it again for you guys though. Like, you know, from where I left off. But then again, you guys wouldn't really know the story like that. But that's okay. Maze like the sewers. This The funny thing about the sewers maze is like the, after the first time we went through it, I understood it. But this, like the Chrysler Tower, Chrysler Building is like randomized, I heard. So it's like, it's different for everybody. The music stopped. We need walking music. I know. I'm hoping that when we get to floor 11, the music will start back up. So we'll see. Uh, is that game free? Which game? We're almost there. I need some enemy cheeks to clap. That would also feel really good. Arthurink. Hold up. Wait a minute. Start with that. Is New Game Plus harder? What's up, One Bullet? Welcome to the show. This is, uh, yeah, it's a little bit more difficult. It's just in this beginning portion of the Chrysler Tower, it's, uh, the enemies are a little bit weaker. See, the way that it's supposed to work is like for every, what is it, five levels you gain in the game, you're supposed to go to the Chrysler Tower and do 10 floors, I think. Uh, we didn't do any of that. So we got to go through the next 60 floors <laughs> together, though. We're doing it as a mission. Oh god, here. See, we already, uh... Well, this is the 10th floor, so it doesn't even matter. We just have to keep going up. We're almost there. The music will start back, I hope. I hope the music will start back soon. If not, I'll start up, uh... I'll uh, play some music in the background while we play. Is there a place to save and reload the game for music? This would be the place here, but let's check. Let's go up and see. There we go. Got it.
We got this eerie music coming back. And this is where the other elevator was. <laughs> if not, will you sing, Blitz? Yes. Dun, 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 dun. Dead end. That's my singing. Okay, thank you. Let's go! Whoa, 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 what the hell? It's a dead end? That was beautiful. Thank you! So good! You guys are the best. The best! Shit, which way did that come from? <laughs> I hope I'm not going backwards. Some of my best singing. Thank you, Renee. It means a lot. It really does. So all the workers to clean up the gooey spider webs and shit. These are the workers. These are their bodies melted into syrup. There's more syrup right there. Which way to go? We gotta go ride the whip, guys. Oh look, a door. Yeah, the cloud dance, guys. <sighs> Shit, I've already been in here. Junk! Drew Dog, what's up, man? Hello, everyone. Good memories of this game, but I could never bring myself to get the true ending. We are trying to get to the true ending right now, my dude. And shout out to the 50 people in the chat, by the way. If you guys haven't yet, hit that like button and subscribe so you can see when we go live for Parasite Eve 2. We're playing a bunch of classics on PlayStation 1 this month. And uh, I would love to have you guys here. So we can enjoy and have a great time. Appreciate all of you guys, really. Damn, so they have like five people standing on every floor? Yo, there's like 70 floors, my dude. Shit, I've already been to this one. I gotta go right. Have I played any of the Ratchet and Clank games? Yes, I have. Pretty much played all of them except... I can't remember if it was Going Commando or Up Your Arsenal that I didn't play. I don't remember which one it was that I didn't play. The music started back up in the game, and more people started joining. <laughs> hey, thank you, Drew. thank you, Drew Dog. I appreciate that. I remember naming my final gun Eve Killer and being so damn frustrated by the final boss, especially after I beat it and died there in the chase after a wrong turn. <laughs> oh shit! It's these guys. Damn it! Oh, you hit like a, you hit for zeros though, man. You solved. Solved. Quest for booty. Oh shit! FBI is in the chat, guys. The Yuffie Sims. You guys gotta run right now. What's up, FBI? This is Parasite Eve. must be Trump Tower. <laughs> the Chrysler building. I think this is the next floor up. Where the stairs at? Yes! We did it! Now we have... 68 more floors to go. <laughs> I like the first 10 floors music better. This floor... This floor is trying too hard, man. At that normal music. And now it's like stupid. Nearly 100k XP to level up. Yep. War Angel, what's up, man? Drew Dog, my gun's name is the Pointy Bits. The shout outs for Tifa. 
about to drive through Memphis, so I need to put up the navigation. Have a good stream tonight, and I'll catch up with everyone on Discord. And if you're not a member of Discord, time to now sign up. Hey, Gamers of Wardello, thank you so much, man. I really appreciate that, man. You drive safe, and uh, hope your GPS keeps it rocking. Boom. I got butt shots in this pistol. I just noticed that. I still wish that poor clown at the beginning had managed to escape. <laughs> Rip clown, bro. He should have listened, man. He ran to the wrong spot, man. We told him, you know, chill. I got you. And he just ran. And all you hear is, ah! dead. Damn it. Dead end. Yeah, join our Discord, guys, when you get a chance. The link is in the chat right there. We have an amazing community. And shout out to you guys for the 50 likes, by the way. 50 likes already on a Parasite Eve live stream. I really appreciate that. Everybody, thank you. Discord is filled with amazing community members. I would love to have each and every single one of you guys in there as well. We have a great time hanging out, chatting, talking, just, just being gamers. You know, it's just, it's just a great feeling. Diego, what's up, man? Must have FF7 Part 2. I agree, man. And thanks, thanks, guys, for the support on the recent uh, video, by the way. I did a video recently talking about changes for Remake Part 2 that I would love to see. There's a continuation of our previous one. Did pretty well. Uh, I have great hopes that it's going to hit the algorithm again. Second time tomorrow, so we should be great. Should be good to go. Should be a fight in here, I think. He started getting fights inside the storage closets. No fights. Be full of Uzi. Oh my god. The range. And then we're gonna get what? Offense up? B Hawk. E card? What? Sid, what's up, man? Hello, Blitz. I tried that goddamn building years ago, but I died at floor 65 or something like that. So if you clear it, you get the game's true ending. Oh my god, you died at 65? I would be pissed. That's crazy. Uh, apparently, yes, yeah, Sid. This is my very first time doing this. So once you get to the final floor, you should be... We should be uh, hitting the... Um, should be a final boss, and then we should be at, uh, you know, endgame stuff. Have you heard the cast voice actors have been recording, but in the same studio? Convenient. That's what I'm thinking too. Like uh, I saw Britt Barron and um, Linda. Well, the girl that voices uh, Jesse. Hey, yo! Look at that man. We on floor 13 now, guys. Yeah, Jesse's voice actress and Tifa's voice actress are both recording in like similar, if not the same exact studios. It's pretty cool. I was gonna buy NHL 21, but I decided I don't like EA anymore. I don't blame you, man. I wait, always wait, like. X amount of years before I buy their next title. Avoided three completely because I heard, had a, had a bad feeling they botched it. Sure enough, but this game is streaming for a killer remake. Drew Dog, I agree. I couldn't agree more, man. Third birthday, I didn't play it, but I've heard so many bad things about it, and I decided to look up a video on it. And it's very true. They 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 ruined it, man. It's horrible. Look at all these bullets wasting. Do 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 do. All these medicine ones. Should definitely drop these. I don't need these. I haven't seen Boruto. I haven't seen a single episode of Boruto. I've been waiting to let it build up before I like jump on and watch it. Because I don't like watching shows. I don't like watching shows that aren't necessarily done. You know, I'd rather... like Because I want to see all the episodes. And watching week to week, man. After what... You know, Naruto itself... KV suit, goddamn. Naruto itself is like a crazy amount of episodes. Can only imagine what they have plans to do with Boruto, so I'm just gonna wait. It's weird that Jessie has lines in the next part. I'm very on edge with her being alive or not. I would love to see her alive, but at the same time, she played a role, and that scene was pretty strong. I agree, although I wonder what exactly they're gonna be doing with that character in that sense. So, I don't know. She does She does still owe him pizza, so... There's that. Get your ass out of the floor. What you doing in the ground? You crazy? 
Do not play third birthday. <laughs> Off topic, I finally started playing Resident Evil 3 Remake. Did anyone else find it absolutely dull? I actually did not play it, but I saw I watched Maximilian play it on the first night, and he was super disappointed. Uh, Resident Evil 3 Remake. Uh, Re Maximilian was very disappointed in it. And uh, yeah, that's pretty rough. The same people that made Resident Evil 2 remake didn't make Resident Evil 3. It was a different, uh, it was a different, um, what do you call it? Different company. This kind of sucks because then when Resident Evil 4 remake comes out, some people are going to be iffy on whether to buy it or not. Especially those people that don't look into which games are developed by who. Next floor, hey, we're getting through this quickly. I think so. Dude, you're not gonna believe this, but I have a core that is long enough, so I'm happy now. Hey, that's awesome, dude. Set it up. Yeah, for some reason they turned down the gore too. I don't get why. Resident Evil 2 Remake Zombies had gnarly battle damage. Yeah, that's weird. I wonder why they did that. Is it because it was a female character? They didn't want to show her getting... Damn! That is so sick. I like that. Gold Saucer could be the center of her role. Story one of the main theories came up with after beating Remake. She's actually in the live stream trying to get her dad back. Cool side story in my opinion. That could be the case. It either could be one... Two things too. It's like we teleported to a different universe. The one where Zack is technically still alive. And uh, in that universe, Jesse's also still alive. I don't know how that would work. I don't think that'll be the case, though. So, I mean, they, they said that they're not going to change up too much with Remake Part 2. But that's changing up a lot. She's alive. I'm going to go this way. I feel like we haven't gone south in a while. Is this a dead end? That's why. That's why we haven't gone south in a while. Jesus! I think all those games are nostalgia for me. Only game I really couldn't put down was FF7. Ah. Has anyone seen Ernest Scared Stupid? Whoa! Oh! Oh! Damn, wow. Zero damage and he's still hitting me with that? Alright. You catching these cheeks. Please die. Dan is throwing out all the classics. Next floor, let's go. Every 10 floors, we'll go save. The safe, that's a safe thing to do. I think we're on 15 now. Who framed Roger Rabbit? I loved Who Framed Roger Rabbit.
outburst is crazy. He hitting buck shots with a friggin' uh, pistol, though. Insane. Jessica Rabbit. One sec, guys. On your knees, I want you to beg for forgiveness. Yo, Shane with the ten dollars, dude. I appreciate that. Blitz channel is where it's at. Clap some cheeks. Thank you so much, my dude. I appreciate the ten. stream among us sometimes it's funny to get rowdy in there yo we uh we had a few we, we streamed among us the other day do definitely want to return back and play it again with you guys do 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 One sec. Yay! Oh wait, got the click back on. E R T Y U, thanks for the sub, man. If you are here, say what's up in the chat. Sorry about that, guys. I was checking something on my phone. Right quick. Yeah, the experience is awful here because they're they're pretty low level. Wait, did I already come from here? I don't know. Are you ready for the Ghost of Tsushima co-op update? Any day now, right? When is it coming out exactly? Enemy fighting here, nice. 
A dino? Get your cheeks clapped. Got that tool on deck. We got so many tools, man. It's crazy. <laughs> a monster? Monster in a box? What is this, Dragon Quest? Oh! it's a lot of damage. Oh my god, these are pretty strong. Ah, I dropped... Mm, I didn't realize that was a revive. I would have taken that. Son of Beach! Damn, man. Missed the revive! Shite! Friday is the ghost update. No way! Why is it taking so long to load? Jesus! Isaac, what's up, man? They got me. Why is it taking so long? Sorry, I got so many notifications on my phone. I'm trying to clear it. Get back to living. Done with Ghost of Tsushima for a good long while after last year. Oh, Drew Dog, I think I think you meant you meant uh Game of Thrones? Oh. <laughs> no, they were talking about Ghost of Tsushima. Yeah, a lot of us are done with Game of Thrones. Elgandis, yo, yeah, we, we've definitely been doing that. We've been using all the tools to upgrade our weapons. If you look, our weapon is 125, 104, and 20. Uh, we're saving them up just because, like, we don't really have all the weapons on us right now. They're back at the 
station. We're just running through right now. Or I'll smash up. G23! All right, 623 Jororo. Thank you so much for the $35, dude. I appreciate that. Hey, your bliss is dropping by here to... Here's to you reaching that top floor and don't give up. I believe in you. Keep eyes safe and keep on clapping. Enjoy your stream, my man. Thank you so much, dude. I, I really appreciate that a lot. That is super generous of you, man. Thank you for the 35. And thanks again, Shane, for the 10, man. Thank you guys. So $45 already on the stream, man. Thank you guys. Yeah, we got that walking music now. It's that intense walking music. Please don't tell me this is down. Oh, God. I never got into Game of Thrones. War Angel, it started off so good. It's a great series. But it just didn't end well. So a lot of people, including myself, aren't very happy with the series as a whole. It's still a good series. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> Thanks for the, the like, Shane. I appreciate that. Guys, if you haven't hit that like button yet, please be sure to do so. We're already at 60 likes. Let's try to get to 70. Guys, just checking out some stuff. What is this? What's up, Isaac? Are you playing online? Are you playing Smash Online right now? Hey, we found the next floor. Sorry about that, guys. Checking out some stuff on my phone. <laughs> I love The Office. Every day, all day, every day, The Office is playing in my house on Netflix. It's always on. Enemy fight. Robert, California. Hit soft. I'm 
Smashing buttons like in Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Who you're playing as? Oh my gosh. Oh, got him before he could even leave. Let's go. I'm super happy and excited when Ness made it as a secret character in Smash 64. Absolutely delighted. No one expected that. Must have been crazy. I remember playing Smash 64 when I was younger than my younger at my cousin's house. Double tools. There's nothing. Nothing fantastic on this grenade launcher. Damn it. Drop it. Chrysler Tower. Well, they're still kind of weak at this point that we're at, but hopefully they'll get stronger. This gotta be a dead end. Oh, it's not. I'm surprised. Just wandering aimlessly. There is like no guide for this really because I've read. I mean, I'm pretty sure there is a guide for this, but like, what's the point? We're just we're just climbing floors right now. We'll clap everybody in our way. Hope that kids have the same exact experiences and emotions with enthusiasm with today's games as we did with the retro classics. I can honestly assure you they don't. <laughs> they don't. It sucks, but today's kids will never experience the same types of feelings we had playing these games growing up and other ones as well. Unfortunate. Has anybody ever played the Dot Hat games? I haven't played the Dot Hat games myself. Exactly, Drew Dog. Exactly. Tools for days. M96. A lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. More medicine ones. Full of capacity. I see what's a better what's a better uh armor hopefully we come across it soon we've got some good stuff now but still some more i'm pretty sure we can find that are going to be even better getting it oh wait should have targeted the bigger one oh what next floor already moving quick guys getting close to 20 they really weren't 18 or 19 
Oh. Oh. Oh, what? I thought I was gonna hit the other one, too. Look at all that ammo! Ooh, fights every screen? Trying to make it interesting. They're trying to slow us down here. Alright, where's snakes at? I know the snakes are coming. There they are. Red City. Are you farming right now, Blitz, or progressing on the Chrysler? We are progressing on the car on the Chrysler. Trying to get through this. I think we're on floor. We gotta be on floor 19 or something like that. Very close. Oh, next floor already. But we're just zooming. Let's look at the Friday's Newt. Uh, actually, look at the KV suit. KV suit's base is 56. Well, 50, 56, 56, 28. Much better. Yeah, it's much better. Not a huge jump. So I don't think I'm going to switch just yet. We're going to wait till we get some crazy. Dead end. They got me, boys. And girls. How's everybody week? How's everybody's week been so far? One sneak? Yeah, right. There you go. I'm like, where's just one sneak? Ooh, hit all three of them. Let's go. Danger noodles. They're creeping up, man. They want to catch these hands. But all they're going to do is catch bullets. Yo, headshot. So I can't believe Rambo is coming to Mortal Kombat 11. Too bad Arnie wasn't available to voice Terminator. We could have gotten some awesome banter and stop or my mom will shoot jokes. <laughs> Who is it, daddy? And what does he do? I'm a cop, you idiot. Stop whining. First, I would like to get to know you. Dylan, you son of a bitch. I can never fully finish this. I'm stuck on the level with the cockroach. There's a lot of them. We're trying to get through the... Uh, by the way, what's up, ERT? I just saw you subscribe not too long ago. We're trying to get through the... So this is the Chrysler Tower. This is like the end game of the game. We're trying to get through it to get to the uh, final ending. See what the true ending is. We got to go through... 50-something more floors? I think we're close to 20. Nope. 
yo we're at 67 likes already guys thank you so much if you haven't yet hit that like button we're almost at 70 appreciate all of you guys man thank you wait there's there are sequels to kindergarten cop i've only seen the first one why I had no idea there are multiple kindergarten cops. That's crazy. Super tool. Club four. Jeez. Beating them cheeks to submission. Defense four. Oh my god. About to hit a hundred hundred on the defense. Got a lot of BP we could use. But I think I'll just hold off on it for now. Did we come we came from the left, so I'm just gonna go right. long hallway hey next floor okay this has to be 20 no way nope one more jesus jesus Yeah, I love Termina Terminator in uh, Mortal Kombat 11. He's one of my favorites, uh, one of my best characters too. Uh, my favorite variation of his is the third one that nobody really uses. Because a lot of people don't know how to use it. You can really lock people down with that third variation, it's crazy. I made a video all about that third variation and it didn't do as well because a lot of people just, they didn't want to look to, they didn't want to learn how to play that one. Which is interesting because it doesn't do as much damage as the other one. But dude, you limit your opponent's resources like crazy. Like they can't do shit. Endoskeleton move deserves a buff. It's absolutely useless. Yeah, it's a custom move though. That's why. Doesn't have much utility. Wait, what? AM44? The pistol. 78. Stronger. Doesn't really give much. The Scarface game voice actor killed it at Sony Watani sounds dead on. That's funny. I didn't think about that game, man. It's hilarious. Moving guys, we're schmoving. I got some ways to go. This floor seems like it's a pretty long one. Double vertical, so we gotta go left. No? Triple vertical? What's going on here? And an enemy. And an enemy. Oh, can y'all group up? Oh my god, please. Yes, let me get her on this side. Hit this dude. It should hit everybody. Come on. Yo, look at that.
Yeah, I only got into Kingdom Hearts because... Well, I used to see the advertisements all the time when I was younger. And I only saw the Disney characters in the advertisements. I didn't know they were Final Fantasy characters until I went over to a friend's house. And he was playing Kingdom Hearts 2. And I saw him fighting Sephiroth. And I'm like, yo, what the fuck is this right now? How are you fighting Sephiroth? What is this? What is this game? Tell me right now. And he's like, yo, it's Kingdom Hearts 2. And I'm like... Are they, in for, are they in the first one? He's like, I don't know. I only have the second one. My friend didn't even play the first one. I was like, bro, I need to borrow this from you when you beat it. So he beat the game and I borrowed it from him and played it. I actually played part two before I played part one. Didn't really care too much for the story. I just, I just love the Final Fantasy characters aspects of it. I didn't care for whatever it was that the characters had going on with them, to be honest. Third one was frustrating. I had so I got the third Kingdom Hearts on. Um, I played all of them for the most part. I didn't play Birth by Sleep, but I played every single one other than that. And I couldn't really get past uh, in Kingdom Hearts three. I was getting really frustrated with like a lot of aspects of the game, so I kind of just like stopped playing it. And I got it pretty early too. I had like a very early copy. Just I don't know. I just wasn't enjoying it. Yeah, the story is a mess and that's why like <laughs> there's a lot of kingdom hearts fans out there that sit there and defend the game but i'll tell you what it's great it's great that you you enjoy the game but the only reason a game like kingdom hearts would make so many prequels across so many different consoles you have to purchase to understand this weird story is because they fucked up they knew that they had a plot hole and they didn't know how to get around it so they were like wait let's make a game that takes place this far back and see if we can fix those issues when a company does that that's just that's a that's a red flag right there for me yo we hit them all What's up, Brian? How you doing? Square Enix lost you at KH3. Yo, me too, man. I mean, I was excited because so many years. I waited so long since Kingdom Hearts 2 to play Part 3 and play the other ones that came out in between. Didn't really enjoy them as much. And Part 3 was just... was weird. I didn't like how they did the lip syncing. Hey, Floor 20, finally. Boss music. Ooh. We got double now and later gators. Let's see if I can hit them. This. Yes, I can. Are you still alive? Um, um. Wait, wasn't there like a stupid medicine I picked up? There's gotta be a medicine too in here. Yeah, there it is. Oh, we're taking that revive though. Dropping that club three. All right, cool. All right, floor 20. Let's get to the elevator on this floor and then we'll go save. And your boy got to use the bathroom and refill up on some water. Ah, oh, the music change. I can dig this music. It's a little bit more annoying. It's, it's a little less annoying than the other one. I like the first floor better. The first floor was like the classic Parasite Eve music. Do, 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 do. Dr. Samurai, what's up, man? It is Wednesday, my dudes. How's everyone doing? I appreciate you dropping by. Whoa, four directions? Excuse me. Hello? Don't 
Oh god, Drew Dog, I had no idea about that with Jeepers Creepers. Where'd you get those peepers? Yeah, in my mind, the series ended at Kingdom Hearts 2. Yeah, there was a turtle plants. Looking for a damn elevator now, though. I'm making some lucky guesses with some of these turns. And we're not ending up in some dead ends majority of the time. I think this is a dead end, though. It's, this is feeling like a dead end. Where it's at. Yup, right there. Fook. Fook the Maywetters. Oh, Jonathan, you got to go down a floor for elevator. That's how that works. Forgot about that. Good thing I saw that message. Well, that's annoying. Let's go. Yeah, you gotta go down to uh, use the elevator, Neglandis. Dun, dun. left left was where we came from <sighs> one of the little things i loved about uh, kingdom hearts 2 was a little slow motion that you got when you finished an enemy or like a boss and it like slow motion zooms in i thought that was like a cool little addition they did to the game yeah, we're gonna drop off a lot of uh, the stuff that we have here oh shit Anthony Giannuzzi with the $50, dude. I appreciate that, man. Gotta go clap that Parasite Eve's cheeks, dude. Man, I appreciate the 50 bomb, my dude. Thank you so much. You have a great night, Anthony. Thank you again, man. Love whenever that uh, notification pops, by the way, guys. This isn't... These aren't elevators, are they? I really wish they were. The Shauna Yell. It's always great whenever the Shauna Yell drops. Let's go down to here. That's what makes it amazing, one bullet. That's what makes it amazing. Twentieth, yeah. All right, let's go all the way down to the forced floor. Save the aim. Hey, Gray, Gray, what's up, buddy? How you doing? Okay? The dog's just looking at me like, shut the fuck up. I apologize, I'm broke as a joke. I work at home health and all my cash is going to gas so I can travel to client homes. Drew Dog, no worries, man. It's all good. We're just here to have a good time and hang out, man. Appreciate your company. Drew Dog, that's super generous of you, man. I really appreciate that. Go to NYPD, drop off a lot of this stuff that we have here, and we'll keep it going. Then your boy can use the bathroom real quick. Re up on some water. You want a doggo?
I'll uh, show you guys Gray when I come back. He's just chilling right. Oh wait, he moved. Wow, I disturbed him. He was behind me getting set it on, settled on the couch, and I lurked back and I like, you know, oh, what's up, man? You good? Or a uh, Cosmo Canyon on a Wednesday? I don't know. Some night, you know, I mean, like, you know, I mean, we 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 could. But I just don't feel like it. Some nights to just get that dranky drink. Take my shit away. Thank you. Hawk. What else? Okay, just the tools. Just the tools. Keep these tools on us right here. Uh, yeah. Other than that, I think we're good. Wait, let me discard some junk. Only one. Oh, I thought I had one. Never mind, I lied. Fake news. What's up, Isaac? I'm just gonna save the game every 10 floors just to be safe. You got it, my dude. I had a good time tonight just being at peace and clogging the chat up. And this may be my favorite song of the game besides the final boss music. Yo, man, you got great taste, my dude. Thank you, Aaron. I appreciate that. Yeah, not much of a drinker, but when I am, I handle it horribly. Not in a red sort of way, but it sort of takes a lot out of me the next day. I feel you, man. I do the same as well. It's like, when I drink, it's like... I, um... I end up waking up later. Even if I go to bed, like, kind of early-ish. It's weird. Like... And it's even like I don't even have to drink that much. It's like I take one drink and it's like I have a good tolerance for alcohol. Like I don't get drunk fast. It takes a lot to get me drunk. But just like one drink always makes me oversleep. All right. This is we're here. I'm going to leave you guys with this song. I'll be right back and use the bathroom. Get some more water. Don't you guys go anywhere. You guys, if you are here right now, please hit that uh, like button if you haven't yet. We're almost at 80 likes. Already at 71. Thank you, whoever just hit that like button. I just saw that. Appreciate that so much. I'll be right back. Don't you guys go anywhere. Thank you again, Anthony, if you're not here. As, I mean, you probably already left. Thank you again for the 50 bucks, man. I really appreciate that. I'll be right back, guys.
I'm back. Sorry, guys. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Boy is good. What's up, Steve? How you doing, man? Lee, you live in Texas, but you're from Florida. Yo. What's up, gamer? Is Gale? How you doing? Hope all is well with you, man. All right, so now we got to go to floor 30. We're on 21. 21, 21. Watch out for Florida man. Hey, Florida man's everywhere. The Florida man. I'm the Florida man. From Manitoba, Brian. That's cool. Let me in. Damn it. Hit the wrong button. This one's weird. You gotta like, mash it up. Mash it up. Atlanta is such a good show. Everyone should watch it if they haven't already. I love Atlanta, man. I'm, I'm waiting. I'm desperately waiting for season three, man. Absolutely love that show, Atlanta. We got to go up one floor. Just. I don't hope I'm going the right way. Yeah, we're doing the Chrysler farm right now. We're trying to get through. I'm not even gonna farm as much. If we find really good, uh, a really good armor and better weapons, we're gonna switch to those, and then we're just gonna finish the last boss. Please tell me I'm going the right way. Please tell me I'm going the right way. I don't think I'm going the right way. I don't feel like it. I feel like we're backtracking. We'll have to see. Yo, Josh, what's up, my dude? Dan, you're still here, Dan. Josh is the one I was telling you about that's an anime connoisseur. You trying out Genshin right now? Nice. How is it? What's next to this once you finish this? Part 2. Parasite Eve Part 2 is going to be next. 
and i'm excited to start that one because i never beat it when i was younger i got really far into it and i would just i would love to just beat that game and see what it's about i have the strangest feeling that i'm walking backwards here just i don't know let's see if i already see hello buddy your shadow he sees his shadow from the the lighting and he's just like what the fuck the fuck is this Steve, you like the purple? Hey, my dude, thank you. You can change it to whatever color it is you want. Just let me know. All right, this is to go. I'm pretty sure this is to go downstairs. It is. I fucked up. And it looks like it. Yep, this is to go downstairs. God damn it. Went all the way. Change the light to black. No. so many games to play like i definitely i want to i want to try out genshin impact i want to play more among us St uh, minecraft steve came out <sighs> so much you know and then we got like in less than a month we got the playstation 5 coming out 20 what 27 days 28 days from now dude she's got to be tired pretty much running around like 30 floors dude 30 floors all across new york this girl's been trucking it on foot it's crazy Uh, Neglandis, that box in the center was an item that I put back in there. The opening scene is nice? Okay. I love the episode when Darius sells the cell phone. <laughs> He's flipping items, man. My favorite episode of, uh, Atlanta. There's a lot. I love the club episode with the invisible car. I love, um... Was his name Teddy Teddy Perkins? The Teddy Perkins episode was really cool. A lot of cool like cinematography in that one. Um, I love the one with the commercials, where they're making fun of all the the commercials, like the Arizona can tea. It's like it costs a it's a it's a it's a, like ninety nine cents, but it comes up to a dollar forty nine whenever you scan it, and they're like, but the price on the candle, the price is on the candle. You gotta build a shelf for that PS5, Diego. Oh, look at this. It was right there all along. These fucking elevators, man. How far do you have to run? So far. Back to here. Finally, we made it. But here's the funny part, Steve. We gotta go up 40 more... 50 more floors. Yeah, everybody deserves an Emmy for that Teddy Perkins episode. Yes. What's funny is uh, Lakeith Stanfield, who plays Darius, he didn't know that uh, that was Childish Gambino the first two days of filming. Huh. Owen Hunt, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing, my dude. Have you seen a TV show called Last Man Standing? Is that the one with uh, Will Will Forte? I think it's called. The bee jacket. What? No darkness? Shit, I'll take that right now. And one trading card. Four. Offense, four, bro. That's a lot of damage. Oh, it's stronger. 55, 62, 32. 55, 61, 30. This is clearly better. What about the KV suit? 56, 56, 28.
do it for now. One oh four. We got so much damage. So much defense. Drew Dog, that's actually funny. My girlfriend's watching Shits Creek right now. She's on season three. I didn't watch it from the beginning with her, but it's kind of cool. Kind of like it. Next floor. Let's go. So this should be floor 21. We're keep, let's try to keep track of the floors, guys. I'm assuming this would be 22 or 21. What do you guys think? Yeah, you can definitely tell it's Eugene Levy's son. Uh, Daniel Levy's actually pretty well known in Canada. He was a MTV host for a long time in Canada. I was like, wait, there's no way. We're going up to the next floor already? Oh, damn, that sucks. You missed out on the meet and greet. Whoa, RC Tolento has become a member? I think uh, that means his membership has resubscribed itself. Thank you so much. I don't think he's on the stream right now. Damn it. Gotta line it up and target the ones in the back. There you go. That's how you, that's how you gotta do it with this, with this gun setup. Bouncer wouldn't let me back in despite having paid money for it. I got to see all three of them board the bus. They said if we wanted to, they'd go drink with us. Damn. That sucks, dude. Range two. Range four. Oh my God. Like crazy. That range on deck. My buddy and I sat by that bus for about two hours until he said, dude, I got to take a shit at the Waffle House. I can't wait anymore. forgive your friend all right let's uh line it up here bust this dude up hey it worked do 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 we could have drank and smoked with the boys and i'll never get that moment back man you gotta take a shit on your friend he's gonna walk into the house and like he'll be like hey what's up man and you just start like pulling down your pants and then you you step on his left arm and his right arm and you hold him down and you just squat right over his face he's gonna be like what are you doing no just gotta do it to him man he's gonna be like drew i thought we was friends baby why you put your cheeks in my face Whoa, whoa. Reload. Damn it, Aya, hurry the fuck up.
Go get some extra hash browns with that shit. <laughs> I love Waffle House too, but damn it, they ru that ruined the whole night. They kept throwing chocolate at Bubbles, so he broke character and walked off stage. Damn. That sucks. Who is it, Daddy? What does he do? Is that pistol firing shotgun shells? Hell yeah. <laughs> I don't understand why people heckle people at a comedy show like bro you paid money to get there why are you fucking with them i don't understand i don't understand the logic behind that like is there some satisfaction some people get out of like heckling professionals and <laughs> At your own risk, you know, to heckle like Dave Chappelle or somebody like that, you'll never forget. You'll never uh, live down that night. They're going to go in on you. Yeah, people have a disorder where they're not the most popular person in the world and it makes them do it, honestly. <laughs> Yeah, it's just weird to me. Like, I just, I never understood that. Like, when I found out that that's a thing, like, people actually get heckled at comedy shows, I'm like, wait, hold on, you're, you're paying money to go see this person and you're just gonna, you're gonna fuck with them like that? What's wrong with you? Why would you do that? I didn't mean to pick up the QRMs. I was at a Lewis Black stand-up show in college, and the opening ad guy kept getting yelled at by the audience in a friendly way, and he finally says, Sorry, there's a fourth wall here. Fuck you. Yeah, if somebody heckled me, like, if I ever did, like, a show like that, or if I did stand-up, I would go into them cheeks. Make it personal. Hurt their feelings, follow them to the parking lot, keep heckling them. Which will ruin the show because I'm pretty sure they'll leave early and I'll just follow them out the door. Where you going, bitch? Your mama got one big titty and one little titty. They call that bitch Biggie Smalls. Oh, wait, whoops. Stairs. What's up, War Angel? Yeah, I did.
don't want to be part of the show so annoying sometimes since that's not part of their routine yeah but certain certain really good comics like jerry seinfeld dave Chappelle, kevin hart they can find a way to heckle them and make it a part of the show and still go on with their regular routine but there are some comics up there that aren't necessarily that great and they could get flustered and i can see where that gets very annoying because i mean like come on man damn it targeted the wrong one Oh my god, I'm so good. Beavis and Butthead. Really love the episode of Atlanta where a guy sold a pair of shoes and said no chase policy. <laughs> that guy in Atlanta with the do-rag, I forget his name. He's like a new character in season two. I hated that dude so much, man. Hated that dude. <laughs> a monster. Okay, cool. So this one's gonna drop a revive, I think. Oh, my god, my cheeks. You know what's funny? So when I started, when I first started like uh, styling my hair in this way, right? There was uh, this girl that was telling me, she's like, she loves my hair. I look like Pauly Shore. I was like, the fuck? How does my hair look like Pauly Shore? She's like, yeah, Pauly Shore. You know, from, from, Jer from Jersey Shore. And I'm like, bitch, you mean Pauly D? <laughs> I was so mad at her, but I was it was hilarious that I couldn't like be pissed. That's kind of funny. I was like, what the fuck? I look nothing like Polly Shore. Fuck out of here with that shit. But she she was talking about Polly D from Jersey Shore. <laughs> I was like, so she combined the show she combined the character with the show, Polly and instead of Polly D making it Polly Shore. <laughs> The faux hawk? No, it's not a faux hawk. Faux hawk is when your hair comes up and it's like pressed together and makes kind of like a triangle. My hair is like it's it's spiked up in the front and it's like kind of like going in a box. Here, I'll make the screen bigger so I can show you guys. So the hair, it's like if it was a faux hawk, this would be like completely touching like that. But that's not the case. I'll make a hair tutorial one day. Yeah, one day when enough people care, I'll make how do I how do I style my hair type of video. Of course, after I get a haircut. Yay! Not a faux hog, man. What you mean? <laughs> I got that college, college pretty. I don't give a fuck. Look, <laughs> we're winning. The Johnny Bravo hair. Yeah, it, it does look like Johnny Bravo's hair. I got that a lot. And um, 
in school. When my hair was longer, people called me Uncle Jesse from Full House. They had it like going backwards. Style hair how to. Yes, yes. Like you just rolled out of bed through some Dapper Dan in the front called it good. We actually, I use uh, Dove. I would love to get a sponsorship with Dove Men, by the way. By the way, Dove Men, I've been using your products since fucking day one. My hair is looking absolutely flawless. Nobody's advertising your shit. Hook me up, man. Jesus. I use Dove Men sculpting paste, the medium hold. The light hold sucks, and the, the, the heavy hold is not good. It doesn't hold as heavy as compared to the medium one, which is weird. Not to mention the medium hold smells like deodorant, which is amazing. The same deodorant I use. It's like a pomade, one bullet. It's like a pomade, but it's a sculpting paste clay. Really good, and it smells amazing. Yeah, Uncle Jesse. Stutter, what's up? My uncle, my cousins would call me Uncle Jesse when I would also grow my hair out longer. <laughs> uncle Jesse. Damn it. products for men well, i mean women don't have a sculpting paste pomade for their hair remember that friends joke unisex no 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 maybe you need sex i already had sex like, no, Joey, you and I sex. Okay, fine. We can have sex. <laughs> Love friends. Love Joey. Joey and Chandler are my favorite characters on that show. And I love, believe it or not, I love, as annoying as, uh, as annoying as Monica is, I love Monica. Just wish she didn't do whatever she did to her, her face. Why didn't David Arquette tell her not to tell her to stop? Stop! No, you don't need to. Why David Arquette? Why don't you stop her? Hey, no worries, McFever. It's all good. Damn it! Never got into Friends. I'm not sure why. Uh, Friends is cool. My uh, my family used to watch it when I was younger, growing up. And as I got older, I just it's it's a, it's a great show. It's like that. Friends and The Office are always on TV in my house. <laughs> David Arquette had a wrestling career. No way. Has anyone ever played FF9? Yes, I've played all the way up to Disc Four, but I never beat it. I was always a Seinfeld mark. Well, I mean, I like Seinfeld too. You like both. You should definitely check out uh, Friends though if you get a chance. Give me a monster to fight. I must break you. BKS. You got it. So many tools. That's funny. My cut is like yours, but I don't style it like that. Hey, Renee, we could be twinsies. Whoa, 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 whoa. So he won the WCW world title, no shit. And he tried to make up for it. The wrestling fans by engaging in hardcore wrestling. His throat got slashed open in a match and it's caught on film. Jesus Christ.
Crazy. David Arquette, um... The... Courtney Cox's, uh, ex-husband. He was also, uh, Dewey in Scream 1, 2, and 3. <laughs> Remember Doofy from, uh, from Scary Movie? Hey, you wanna smell my fingers? What's that? My ass? <laughs> I love Doofy. What floor are we on? I lost count, my dude. I think we are on floor 24, 25. We've got some ways to go. I told you not to bother me while I'm cleaning my room. With the vacuum. Doofy's the man. Created a tool for a super tool. Twenty-seven, eh? One bullet. We keep in count. Thank you. <laughs> I remember how shocked people were in theaters, especially when the glory hole, uh, glory hole kill happened. You know, it's funny. I watched Scare Movie One at a drive in our in a drive at a drive-in theater with my family. My cousin, my cousin Kevin, was there too. It was funny. I remember my mom being mad, and my dad was like laughing. <laughs> Damn it. Created the, created the one in the middle. Freddie Prince Jr. is a writer for WWE and taught a class at NXT's promo school. Freddie Prince Jr. also streams playing games. Full time, actually. I follow him on Twitch. Wish him all the best, man. He's a cool down to earth kind of guy. It makes me think that his character in that episode of Psych, where he plays, um,. Sean and Gus's uh, best friend from when they were kids, who was like a real big like super nerd, and still is a super nerd as an adult, but has like a hot wife and he's like really rich. I think that that uh, character is actually him in real life. <laughs> what does he know about wrestling? I mean, you don't really got known anything about wrestling to be to write storylines. Psych is an amazing show, G.I. Yeah, Rocky. Uh, I watched the movie recently, that one that came out with Lasseter. Love Psych. James Roday and uh, Dulé Hill. Phenomenal duo. They are so good. You guys remember that movie back in the day, Basketball? <laughs> Does anybody remember that movie? <laughs> I rented that movie so many times. Yo, it was always on TV back in the day. Always on TV. That movie, the big hit, which I think was a Mark Wahlberg movie. Armageddon and another one with a meteor. No, no, Armageddon is the one with the meteor, right? Yeah. Basketball is hilarious. <laughs> Get closer. Who is it, Daddy? And what does he do? I'm a cop, you idiot. You know what's another good movie I used to watch back in the day? Face Off. I love that movie. No matter how silly that concept is, that movie is... <laughs> it was actually on TV the other day. <laughs> the 
Mark 23. Damn. That's a lot of damage. He's out of control. Fuck! Yeah, face off was cool. Are you hating one bullet? What are you hating for, man? <laughs> oh, God, this floors. Help me, please. Where's Ja? Help me, Ja Rule. Final Fantasy IX is a good game. We're going to be playing it on stream eventually. That's a game that I want to go back to and play. Blasted your fool. Are you afraid of the dark? Yo, hell yeah. There's a Canadian show, I think, too. Used to show at uh used to show Nickelodeon for us. I think we got one more floor to 30. Yeah, are you afraid of the dark and goosebumps? Goosebumps. Oh, you mother of the bitch. How dare you? Fuck you. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck is this floor? Uh, let's go up. Let's go Nart. We came from right. Let's go Nart. Fuck! Wrong way. Not even gonna give us an enemy to fight there. Come on, man. Come on, Lee. Come on. Come on. Oh, extended hallway. Legs. What am I doing with my legs, Charlie Murphy? Damn it. to hear the walking music yes <laughs> another 
Another plus? This is annoying. I can go anywhere. Say that shit. Oh. Inventory full. There. What do you have in here? Show me. Your nudes collection, please. Thank you. Offense. It was offensive. Let's be buying bots now. What happened? What, what happened with the bots? Tool for tool. What did down uh what did down Rouser do? Oh. Yeah, Dan's been asking <laughs> Dan's been asking us about movies all like all uh the whole stream. Hope you're a real person, Dan. Hope you're a real friend. Shit, I gotta go right. Came from the left. Don't get turned upside down. Go this way? Chicken undercooked. Ugh. Undercooked chicken. Ah, oh, man, I'm cooking that shit all the way through. Double cook. Oh, I know, Isaac. No worries. Yo, what is this, dude? Okay, so up. I feel like I'm just getting sent back to the same spot. So up would... Up to the right, maybe? Because we went left, and left took us around, so... That is the only way I can think of. Oh, look, the enemy. Might have been right. Let's get behind these motherfuckers. Don't worry, Dan will be back. Oh, wait, was that a door? Hold on, let me go back. Yo, what is this floor? I don't understand what's going on here. If this is one that I've already been in. Yeah, it is one that I've already been in. Come on. What is this shit? I can't get jiggy with this shit. Go. Let's go right. Okay. I get up here again. On how we were south. I'm on like floor 29 right now, Jose. But I am confused to shit right now because I keep ending back up at that uh, four way turn. So I'm hoping to find a way out. Why? Okay, wait. I think this might be right. Hope so. I think we're on the right track. 
We're almost two likes away from 80 likes, guys. Thank you so much for all the likes. Next Friday? I love next Friday. Of course, the first Friday is my favorite. Are you talking about movies or are you just saying next Friday? <laughs> yeah, the spread on this shit crazy. It's enough to spread them tricks. Uncle Elroy and Auntie Sugar. <laughs> came out wearing the gimp mask yeah, of course Chris Tucker hey everybody Smokey back here taking a shit he's out oh my neck my back my neck in my back Well, actually, one bullet, uh, both Ice Cube and Chris Tucker have a script ready for a Friday movie with them in it. The only thing is, and Ice Cube has submitted it four times, but the production company has been turning it back, saying that they need to hold off on it right now. This, that this movie shouldn't be released yet, basically. And uh, Ice Cube's pretty pissed about that. because He's like, so when the hell should it be released? And I went to a, I went to a stand up where Chris Tucker was in my town three years ago, and I went to a stand up at the Hard Rock, and somebody asked him about like you know when the, when's the next time he's gonna be doing another Friday, and he said that he actually confirmed it right there. He's like, I talked to Ice Cube about it. We have a script ready. It's just we're waiting for the uh, the green light to start working on it. Uh, actually, it was before uh, John Witherspoon passed. How high? Oh yeah, how high too? Was how high too the one with uh, Lil Yachty and um, DC Youngfly? Definitely not gonna be better than the first one, of course. What is this? Bufu? Buy us? Fuck you! <laughs> Nah, I can't be the same character because, I mean, it'll be years later, Smokey's older, so he can't be still on his drugs and shit. Charlie Murphy being dead was crazy. But didn't, didn't know. Honestly, if they want to bring the boondocks back, um John Witherspoon's son does a very good impression of John Witherspoon. His son is a um is a YouTuber, JD Witherspoon. And he does a really good impression of his dad, so I think that, uh, that'd be pretty cool if they did that. And you know this man! Smokey probably owns a dispensary. Yeah, there you go. Nadia with the, the plot, the plot lines right there. Damn it. Tar I thought I targeted the other turtle. Let's use some of this medicine so I can free up some space. Yeah, Mac Miller dying was insane, and for real, Kobe. Craziest death for me is uh, Michael Jackson.
Kobe and Chester Bennington. Those are three deaths that really made me cry. Shocked me to my core, especially the Michael Jackson one. to Aaliyah a lot growing up but my cousins were like huge fans of her of course and I liked their music too but I was too young to really feel the impact of Aaliyah dying and how crazy it was and then as I got older and I realized how, how actually young she was it was crazy to me to think that she died in that way yeah Chris Cornell died and then a month later Chester died they were both really close really really close I didn't I didn't know I didn't notice if you were spamming or not McFever it's all right yeah, and Prince yeah, I still don't think um I don't think Prince died in that way that they said he did Prince dies and old catalog open for sale just like that the catalog that he swore that he wouldn't uh Share around so willy nilly. A monster. Yo, <laughs> what's up, Darren? Well, you know, Sony hooked up the doctor that killed Michael Jackson. This man served what three years? Less than less than four years in jail. Killed an icon. Out free. No practicing medicine. Well, Michael Jackson didn't inject the propofol into himself, Dante. Uh, propofol, you can't, you can't. In, the amount of propofol that was injected into Michael Jackson, you can't inject that on your own. That's not true, Drew Dog. As soon as one drop of propofol touches your blood, you're out instantly. Oh, look at that. Floor 30. Finally. Ouch. All right, he should be dead on this one. Oh, he's still alive. He's kicking. Oh, he's gonna split up. I forgot, he splits up. Let's kill the head. Come on, reload, reload, reload. Get on this side. Oh. Ah, I targeted the wrong one. Wait for the darkness to wear off. I thought I had darkness protection on this. Love this song. Ooh, the last one almost got me. I could have died right there. All right, I gotta be more. I gotta be more careful. I'll actually, heal better. regular tool there it is they found weed at mj's house and they somehow mistook that for marijuana what oh mistook for heroin not marijuana i was like huh they mistook weed for marijuana <laughs> Oh, 
All right, let's go. Let's go save. Gotta go down. Yeah, for sure, Renee. Yeah, Prince was the man. Dude had crazy talent. I'm glad him and uh, MJ squashed their beef way before they died. It would have been cool to see them collaborate together, but... Michael was at that point in his life where he was just... Trying to hold things together, man. People were just dogging this man left and right over the most outlandish shit. They actually called Prince before he toured to ask Prince for advice on touring. Because Prince had a really successful tour in the late 2000s. Yeah, MJ and Prince, they squashed their beef before they died. Before MJ died. Drop off some shit. Thankful you guys enjoy the MJ talks, McFever. There's a lot of people out there that still believe those crazy things about him, and I'm not gonna like nobody's ignorant, really. They're just. Or just uh, not enlightened to the facts, so I'll more than gladly teach people if they need it. Freaking inventory, man. Chase us. Yeah, Michael Jackson. Uh, Michael Jackson did have interest in sex. He had sex with lots of females. Lots of women documented uh, crazy moments that they had with him. Even Pharrell, Pharrell Williams went to go work with Michael Jackson in a studio. Michael showed up with two girls and he kissed one on the mouth. Like, full on, like, was making out with them in front of him. There's lots of stories that people have of Michael Jackson actually like being intimate with women and it was a time and place for everything like that. He was a really private person with that stuff, but it's not really well known. Just that Sony and a lot of crazy people out there paid top dollar for the most outlandish and craziest fake Michael Jackson news. All the stuff that was brought up about MJ that was ever put into court was full on disproven. FBI went ahead and investigated this man for 10 years straight. FBI couldn't convict... FBI has a 98% conviction rate. They couldn't convict a black dude. That everybody was so sure was guilty. After investigating him for 10 years. Random searches. When he's home, when he's not home. It's insane. Yeah, we're going back to the Chrysler building. I just had to save. It's kind of messed up, Tracy. He had a skin disease. Oh, vitiligo? He was still a black person. That's kind of... That's offensive, man. You don't... Uh... <laughs> Thank you. 
so what happened with the Pepsi commercial? Michael Jackson, his he hit, vitiligo runs in his family from his dad's side. He had vitiligo on his hand. That's why he wore the glove. Uh, after that Pepsi commercial where his hair caught on fire, he had surgery on his head to repair his head, but he didn't change his skin color. What happened was the pigmentation from fire was burnt out on his uh, top of his scalp. So we had to apply extra makeup there. If you look, uh, I mean, that happened in 84. Michael Jackson's skin didn't turn full on white until the late 80s, early 90s. He tore it openly and stuff. Even during the victory tour, he had like barely any eyebrows because they were singed off from the burn. He didn't full on bleach his skin. What he did was his skin was getting lighter in areas. So his makeup artist was blending it. That's why his skin started to get lighter over time. He wasn't bleaching his skin. Eventually to the point where it got crazy, where they couldn't blend his entire skin with the brown makeup that he would use normally. So they ended up having to use white makeup. Oh, this song. I like this song for this floor. So later in his career, he used a lot of white-ish makeup to cover up the whiter pigmentation. I know a lot of people with vitiligo. My, one of my uncles has vitiligo on his face. He's a brown. He's actually darker skin than me much darker skin than me and his fate is like full-on white patches all over <laughs> to be honest it sucks that he was insecure about that stuff because if he was like winnie harlow he would just i would just say full-on full embrace it you know like you're fucking you're michael jackson nobody's gonna care if your skin is like you know patched up like own that shit but he's not that type of person he's very self-conscious self yeah he didn't want to be white he just he had no choice That's all right, Tracy. Yeah, ever since the, ever since that fire accident with his head, he got addicted to painkillers. And uh, eventually, throughout his life, he just kept getting injured. In the '90s, he had he did a tour, and while he was doing a Earth song, the scaffolding he was standing on broke, and he fell like 40 feet, landed on his feet, and fucked up his back. This happened in the late '90s, '97, '98. And uh, because of that, he got addicted to painkillers again. And then him and Lisa Marie Presley broke up because he didn't like that he was so crazy with like his pills. But what could he do? They had a hold on him. The Waynes brothers were such good uh, friends of Michael Jackson that they dropped out of Scary Movie 3 because they didn't like what scary movie 3 was doing with michael jackson's image that's why the last one they were in was in scary movie 2. Sorry, I'm trying to catch up on messages. Captain EO, yeah. You know who I love? I follow and I absolutely would love to collaborate and work with one day is Michael Trapson. He's a Michael Jackson impersonator, but he's what Michael Jackson would be if he was a trap artist now. And I, I fucking, I love Michael Trapson. I think he's amazing. I love what he's doing for MJ's image. It's pretty cool. He actually has a Captain EO, a Trapson EO, homage to Captain EO. Do you know why he changed his nose shape? Yeah, so when he was um, 
When he was younger, his nose was biggish, and people used to make fun of him. Like his dad and them used to call him Big Nose. So around the Thriller era, he did his nose. Well, actually, sorry, no. After after the Off the Wall era, he did his nose, but the first nose job messed up with his uh, ability to hit the high notes. So he did his nose, and personally, I think what he, what, what he did to his nose during the Thriller era was perfect. But he actually, during a uh, rehearsal, was doing a spin. You know those crazy spins that he does? He did, he did a spin so hard that he lost balance and he fell on his face and he broke his nose. And it had to get, he had to get surgery on it to repair it. Oh, Drew Dog, that was actually planned by Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson and his brothers, the Jackson 5, they always did that thing where somebody would come on stage and they would like overstay their welcome and MJ would have to force them to leave. He did that with Slash as well too. Gail, have a great night, man. Thank you for hanging out with us. Yours and my uncle were never famous with that disease. Honestly, feel like bad was uh snubbed out of the awards that it got like bad was amazing i think bad is his best album all of his albums are great but bad was definitely definitely an amazing successor to thriller every song on bad is great you know but because at that time michael jackson purchased the sony catalog michael jackson owned half of sony him and sony were at war because they didn't like that they didn't like a black person owning 50 percent of sony's shares i mean he had he had a uh, he owned basically legally owned the Beatles catalog and all new music that would come out that Sony would uh, obtain. And ultimately that Sony catalog that he purchased in the 80s uh, is what got him killed. Because Sony didn't want him to have that catalog. This is not going to hit him. Oh, it did hit all three of them. Hey, let's go. Hey Diego, uh, I just saw your message. I don't know, so you might be new to this, but on our on our channel, on this channel specifically, we don't talk about any politics at all whatsoever. Any talk about politics is banned on the live chat, the Discord. That's just that's not what this platform is for. We're here to enjoy, have fun with video games, and occasionally talk about music and all that stuff. But politics talk is just. I don't know. I just, I prefer not to have it on the channel. Hey, no worries, man. It's just... I like the I like the relationship we all have. We all get along really well. We all we're not toxic at all. We're, we're we have an amazing community, you know. And unfortunately, it's just one of those things where politics and political topics just people just don't agree on. And I prefer to keep it away from that because we all agree on one thing. We all love Final Fantasy. We all love these games. We all love all these old school games. And I prefer that to be the focus. Curious, what's up, man? This is floor thirty three, I think. Yeah, we're 33, I think. I want to say 34, maybe. Mm -hmm. Damn. It's always so tough to know which way to go. I'm wondering if, like, following the, the syrup is a good way to tell where to go.
Hey, no worries, Drew Dog. We we stream for a very long time on this channel, so you are at the right place. Got him. That scissor. Do, 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 do. There are 70 floors, James Fowler. 70 floors. Here it says Blitz, thanks for the inspiring Legend of Dragoon playthroughs. I almost maxed out all of Dart's editions without the Ultimate War God. Yo, that's amazing, dude. Keep it going. A monster. Do these guys always drop a revive? Let me see. Try not to get hit by him. Oh my god. Just can't avoid that. Okay. Just never open that when you're at low health. No worries, Renee. It's all good. Appreciate that. Saving those uh those uh, medicine fours. Yo, we got 56 people in the chat, man. Thank you guys so much. We're almost at 80 likes. Let's try to get to 90 likes, guys. If you haven't yet, hit that like button. I appreciate all of you guys dropping by and hanging out with us as we run through the Chrysler building in Parasite Eve 1. Ooh, what? Blue? Nice. We're getting we're getting into more uh, durable enemies, which is pretty cool. A lot of the hate that ICP got back in the day was off of Eminem. <laughs> And we hit 80 likes, guys. Thank you so much. I just saw that. I appreciate that so much. I think following the slime. Follow, I mean, syrup. We're going to say slime, man. It's syrup. The syrup. Actually takes you to where you got to go. You tried using Miranda on your Legend of Dragoon playthrough. How'd that work out? Four boxes in here. One of them's got to be an enemy. PSG-1, hold on a second. We're going to find a sniper rifle. We're going to find ammo for the PSG-1. Damn. <laughs> Full cure. That was a good snake. Drew Dogs, uh, Big Boss, and Solid Snake are my favorite. Well, Metal Gear is my favorite video game series of all time. I don't know if you can see right here, but there's actually a Big Boss poster to my left. Right here. Right next to MJ. And right next to Grey Grey. There's Grey Grey right over there. He's just chilling. What's up, boy? Yeah, Big Boss and uh, Solid Snake are my favorites. Well, let me pull that to the oh, right. No, I should go left. Nah, you're still not going to be able to see it. Just the way that the monitor is. Wow, I actually put it back perfectly. Nice! Next to MJ. Hee <laughs> hee! Oh, my voice. I can't do the hee hees anymore. Hold on. Hee <clears> hee! <throat> Thank you. 
MGS3 is my favorite. My f absolute favorite Metal Gear. Uh, I heard Dexter is coming back, yeah, for a 10-part uh, short series. I wonder if it's going to continue into his Lumberjack stuff. Ah, oh, so falling to slime doesn't work. We follow the slime to the failure. Boss. Those are rookie eyes. They're transplants. <laughs> Damn it! I didn't want to pick up that. What's Grayson playing with? He's uh, he's got a little treat. He's got a little uh, treat, like it's like a, like a little bone treat. He just loves like tossing it up and like clawing at it, playing with it before he eats it. Madness hero. You haven't even taken the safety off, rookie. Colonel. I'm trying to sneak past the guards. But I'm too dummy thick. My ass cheeks are clapping, alerting the guards. I think, is that, what it, is that how he says it? I'm trying to sneak around. But I'm too dummy thick. My ass cheeks keep clapping and alerting the guards. Madness hero! Oh, uh, trust me, uh, Omen. A lot of us were disappointed with the way that uh, Dexter ended, but apparently it's coming back. I heard about that today. On Showtime, 10 episodes. Did you see the death battle of Solid Snake and Sam Fisher? No, I didn't, but spoil it for me. Who wins that? Yep, Dexter is coming back, and Michael C. Hall is confirmed to reprise his role. Michael C. Hall? Wait, Michael C. Hall had cancer? That's a solid snake voice. Thank you. I had no idea Michael C. Hall had cancer. Wow. That's crazy. Did you know him and uh, Deb were actually married in real life? I think they have a kid together. Wow, I had no idea, man. Dexter is one of my favorite shows. Me and my girlfriend, we watch it from time to time. We don't always watch it all the way through because, you know, we, we skip around to like seasons that we like. Wait, I don't understand. What voice, what voice did Michael C. Hall used to do? Sorry, I'm missing it. Every time I think of Deb from uh, Dexter, I always think of her role in White Chicks. Tina, they're talking, tell me. <laughs> I'll never look at uh, the actress who plays Deb the same. And Terry Crews was the MVP of White Chicks, of course, without a doubt. Without a doubt.
Oh my god, Drew Dog. I love that's my boy. I love Adam Sandler movies, no matter how bad or stupid they are. But it might as Jack and Jill. I don't think I watched that one. I don't think I care to. But um I love all Adam Sandler movies, man. And Vanilla Ice and That's My Boy was fucking hilarious. It's like, hey, didn't, didn't you make enough money off of that, you know, that song you had? Ice Ice Baby's like, nah, man. Every time that song plays in rotation, I own I owe Queen like 75 cents. <laughs> That's hilarious. I feel like I've been here already. Suge Knight got the other 60%. <laughs> yeah, wasn't it Queen that he said? Or Pressure? I feel like I'm going the wrong way. I don't know, Darren. We gotta figure this out, man. Damn it, hit the wrong one. Yeah, fuck Shook Knight. I already, already passed here. I just don't know which way from here I gotta go. I'm assuming... Okay, once you pass the elevator, that should be the right way. So let me just go back right. Maybe take a different direction when I get to that hallway. Shug has alluded to many times that he killed Eze. He He did it on Jimmy, on, uh, Jimmy Kimmel. Basically said, you know, there's a, there's a new way to kill people. You can get a... Ju a, a syringe of somebody's blood that's contaminated with hiv and injected into a person and they get that die slow and then he said that easy e stuff like damn bro as if you just felt like you had big ass balls god damn yeah yeah drew dog that's exactly what i was talking about Shook Knight's a loser. He tried to he tried he tried to uh, do something on the set of Straight Outta Compton, and he ran over some people at that uh, donut place. And I think he's still serving time in jail for that. So fuck him. He didn't get locked up for any of the other crazy shit that he did, but sure as hell is on some bullshit. Yeah, he wasn't even that good of a producer or a rapper. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you could argue with that too and say like, you know, what Suge Knight did, right? What Suge Knight did to Tupac to take him out of the picture own his masters and you know keep his music in rotation and keep making money off of that that's exactly what you know sony did to mj and it's a sad thing but that's what's happening to a lot of these artists nowadays which is why it's crazy to be like you know working with a crazy big label i think if you're really getting into music man it's just you're better off going independent as much as, as much of an independent artist as you can be Oh yeah, Master P is one of the one of the realest ones in the game. Thought you have to create those rap snacks. Oh, wrong way. I haven't had the Migos flavor. And he has a uh, wrap noodles too now. Uh, 
I hope Snoop, uh, not Snoop Dogg, sorry. I hope DMX figures out uh, his uh, path because Snoop Dogg helped him out big time with that clash. After that clash that uh, Snoop Dogg and DMX had, DMX got a lot of uh, got a lot of followers and clout off of that. So I do hope this man finds a way. Cause what's crazy is like, yo, DMX was bigger than Jay Z, much bigger than Jay Z. They were like two artists that were technically not really competing with each other, but technically they were. And Jay Z is just gigantic, gargantuan. It's insane. And for DMX to be negative 10 million in the hole, it's like, wow. Okay, I went the wrong way. Damn it. Boom, boom, boom. Wait, is this the go where I came from? It is. I think I was going the right way. Okay. My bad. I think I, I do have to go right. Oh yeah, Omen. We are random as hell, man. We're just trying to, we're just chilling and grinding through these. Well, let me, uh, see what's going on here. love jay-z seen that man perform live so many times and i'm always surprised each and every single time <laughs> shit didn't want to drop that all right let me use this one time yeah nobody likes jaw rule <laughs> When we were younger, my cousin Kelly was a, the biggest Ja Rule fan. And my, my other cousin Kevin used to like make fun of her. <laughs> Eric Chin, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. You are here in the chat, my dude. Say what's up. What would I be without you? Oh. <laughs> that sounded like Jaw Roll. <laughs> that was Barrett. <laughs> Wait. I go south. This is where I came from just now. I think Derek said I had to go south of the three way. He was wrong. Sure, Isaac. You guys can help with this tremendously. I, I personally don't want to. Um, I don't want to figure this out on my own. <laughs> I just want to get out of here. Hey, we did it. We did it. Not this three way. Oh no. I know it's hard to type out the directions, like especially when you guys are like on a delay. I think you guys are, you, some of you guys are on like a 30 second. Some of you guys are on a 10, 15 second delay. It's Gucci. Burr. I love that Gucci man like fixed himself, dude. 
Bro, this man was like overweight. Looking stupid. <laughs> Became healthy. I'm all for it, man. Become healthy. Reform your image. I used to listen to Gucci Man all the time in high school. Mainly because all my friends did. And I was like, alright, well, I mean... I'm driving, they're the ones with the aux cord, so... It made sense at the time. Dave Franco is doing a Vanilla Ice biopic, really. But man, it's stunner. Oh, that was the easiest stairs. No, it's not stairs. I lied. Fuck. Yeah, Drake's been phenomenal. Like, I try to hate on Drake early on in his career, man, but... Dude, seen that man live a few times as well. Dude is awesome, man. What can you say? And I respect Drake a lot when um, he released the 2C Slide song for him to include, like, Michael Jackson in there. Because uh, it was at that point... There was a big shift in the narrative of Michael Jackson and uh, those rumors that people were making up with him the, pri the year prior. There was a lot of people that were like writing him off and then because of like Drake saying that it brought back the conversation and a lot of people found the truth and were enlightened to the fact that MJ didn't do those things that he did. Oprah is a lying bitch. And all is almost well in the world. I still come across my uh, every now and then like, you know, MJ hater that like literally, literally somebody once wrote a comment on my uh, thing that they won't subscribe to me because I have a child, uh, a pedophile on the back here. And I went ham on that guy in the comments, but you know, I don't care about his subscription. I'd, I'd rather educate somebody. You don't have to subscribe to me if you don't want to. Just don't be a bitch about it. You wouldn't say that shit to my fucking face. I'll whoop your motherfucking ass. Boy. Yeah, I don't need him at all. Fuck the toxicity. Toxicity of our city in our city. When was that? That was... I can't even tell you, man. We made so many videos. It's insane. It had to be a live stream video because he would have seen... He would have seen the, uh, the MJ image in the background on those. Yeah, I was a Drake hater too, Diego. But man, Drake's doing his thing, man. It's just consistently hit after hit after hit. Ghost Riders are not, man. The dude just, he's on it. He could have the best Ghost Riders in the game, dude. And it's just, it's insane. You know, it's also sad, Drew Dog. So HBO obviously did that documentary of uh, Michael, the fake Michael Jackson allegations, and they pretty much put their stamp of approval on it. Which MJ's uh, MJ's attorneys and stuff are actually suing HBO for that because MJ actually did a series of concerts and he actually gave the rights to HBO to air them. And in that concert is that they can't slander his name, which they did with that film. So they're actually being sued right now by that, but. My other point to bringing that up was that um, the uh, fuck. What was my point to bringing that up? Let me read your message again. Yeah, MJ is not a pedophile. 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 It's fucking fake news, dude. Damn. What the fuck was my point that I was trying to make? Now I'm mad. Hold on, let me see. Read back your messages. Oh, okay. My point was HBO. So here we go. HBO. Actually, I just reread it. So HBO, uh, because they did that, right? Basically, all HBO would release is like anti-Michael Jackson stuff. Like there was actually a documentary about the um, fuck. What's the name of the theater? The Apollo Theater in Harlem, right? like how the apollo became famous for like you know hosting black artists and all that stuff and being crazy like you know 
being really big for their career. Would you believe the Apollo did not talk about the Jackson 5 performing there? You know how many legendary shows the Jackson 5 had? Like when they were younger growing up and up and coming and stuff like that that put the Apollo on the map? And they purposely, HBO purposely edited them out, cut them out of that documentary. When MJ died, up until those allegations came back around in 2014, they fully supported Michael Jackson. The Apollo did. Now look what they fucking did. This shit was fucking garbage. Oh, flight the uh, the basketball YouTuber, Diego. Look at MJ, man, being so inspiring. Your dad nearly beat you after Super Bowl 1993. MJ performed, and my soon-to-be stepmom said, "What a freak!" Damn. That sucks, because that was the year that those allegations came out. Anybody a fan of Childish Gambino? Hell yeah! Love Gambino. Love the TV show Atlanta. Can't wait for Atlanta Season 3. It's one of my favorite shows. I rewatch, I rewatch Atlanta from time to time. It's such a great show. It's so well done. I would love to be on an episode of Atlanta. Damn, Drew Dog. You should have told her to look at the man in the mirror. It's <laughs> pretty much what you said, though. You know what's crazy? Michael Jackson's the most photographed celebrity of all time, and he doesn't rewear a lot of his the clothes that he wears when he goes out. Would you believe these motherfuckers in the allegations had the audacity to say that one year at Thanksgiving, they Michael Jackson basically took them from their family and like forced them to stay with him at his house and have like rough like adult sex and all that crazy shit? When on Thanksgiving Day, Michael Jackson was actually doing a concert in Budapest. It's like well on documented that he was in, he was on the other side of the world compared to where they said he was doing a fucking concert. Kidding me? Eight year old you wasn't that sharp yet. It's all good, man. <laughs> Did they have other motive for doing such edits or so other than being an MJ hater? I mean, it's propaganda pieces, man, to slander a person's name because when you're dead, the, the dead's name isn't protected. You can actually, uh, I forgot what they said, the de the deceased, you can, um, you basically can say whatever you want about the deceased and they can't defend themselves. They have no rights because they're technically dead. Michael Jackson's uh, nephew, Taj Jackson, has been doing a phenomenal job uh, going to interviews, talking to people, bringing out the truth about his uncle and all that stuff, and 100% support him. I would love to have Taj Jackson on the channel one day. I gotta DM him, because he always checks his DMs too. But I would love to have him on here and just, you know, on a live stream, just chat with us, with us all. I've watched all of this man's interviews, studied this dude. You also told her she had a mustache when you guys went to go see Dennis the Menace and driving. <clears throat> Drop off the PSG one MP44 trading card. Jesus, a monster! You can't get away from these, which is it sucks. You take that hit. I run left. Can I get hit? Oh, I still get hit, bro. Sorry, four shots killed this kills this. Damn, all crits. Let's go. Yeah, I love Paris Jackson. Paris Jackson, uh, BG Jackson, which is Blanket, but he changed his name to BG. And uh, Prince Jackson actually all have a uh, 
a YouTube channel called Film Family where they review films. They don't do it anymore right now because of COVID. But uh, they've been, uh, I, I love that channel. They have really good insight on um, movies and stuff. And you hear them say all the time, like, you know, like their dad showed them this old film and like they, you know, basically you can see like the, the stuff that uh, MJ install, instilled in them from a young age, which is pretty cool. Your dad was denied them cheeks. Because he made her feel <laughs> insecure about her mustache. Her mustache, yo. No, all his moves, man. All of his moves. I just gotta get in better shape to hit those moves. Yo, 82 likes, guys. Thank you so much. If you guys haven't yet, keep hitting that like button. Get to 90. We're almost there. What floor are we on? I think we're on 30. We gotta be on 37, 38. We gotta be pretty much up there. Maybe we're on 40. Who knows? So I've been away a little while because I've never played Parasite Eve. Is this like a Palace of the Dead type of unlimited floors thing? Omega, it's got 70 floors. We just got to get through it to get the final true ending. I've come too far now. 83 likes, guys. Thank you so much. And I think this is another dead end. This just feels like a dead end. Oh, it's not. I lied. Fake news. All right, let's just try. I'm gonna try going up. Seeing if going up will actually help. Oh, yes. Did it. You can do it. Bite his freaking head off. Uh, James, we actually didn't start climbing three hours ago. I actually, we started off today at floor 11 because I already had the first 10 on the previous stream. Oh, I forgot. You gotta actually, you gotta actually kill the ball. Yeah, fuck it. You know, it's a show I love so much that I watch almost all the time. Every time I'm eating is uh, Modern Family. Modern Family is one of my favorite shows. Can't believe it's over. Is the secret ending super good? I have no idea, James. This is my, this is my very first time doing it. And I'm doing it because you guys are awesome. And I love hanging out with you guys. Yo, Drew Dog, thanks for the $5, dude. I appreciate that, man. That is super generous of you, man. I really do appreciate that. Shower. I just wanted to try it out, you know, see what it's like. All that good stuff. 42? Damn, isn't that an LMG? evade yeah dude modern family is amazing i have no idea what floor we are on omega uh i think i forgot i think maybe Darren was keeping track or one bullet maybe we will have to see That'll keep me from buying a pack of smokes, dude. Hey, happy to contribute to that, Drew.
Oh yeah, I've been using the medicine twos slowly. There we go. Just using them and tossing them whenever I can. Every 10 floors, we go back to the uh, police station. Fuck. Every 10 floors, we go back to the police station. We drop off all the uh, stuff and save. Just in case. Either 38 or 39. I hope we are on 39, Derek. I think we got to go south now. Because I went left, went up. Don't recall anything cool happening. Thanks, Drew Dog. I appreciate that. One of my favorite things about streaming is that uh, is the favorite thing, of course, is the in, the in, why can't I say connection that we get with each other? I get getting a chat with you guys and all that stuff. There's 77 floors. <laughs> well, I guess they had to be realistic. I feel like I'm backtracking right now. Fuck. Am I going backwards? Because I haven't fought an enemy in a while. I hope not. But this is where I wish that the uh, the speed up function was working properly. Okay, there's an enemy fight here. Yeah, dude, I wouldn't have the patience to do this off stream at all. Like seriously, I do wish I knocked out like ten floors earlier, but I didn't. <laughs> I didn't play Final Fantasy 13 when it came out. I actually didn't play it at all. Oh, yo, floor, floor 40, guys. Floor 40, we did it. Fuck, but the elevator is so far from here. Okay. Did I set her thoughts? Ouch. I'm gonna cast haste on the next. Maybe I can outrun this. this zoop, zoop, boop, boop. Oh, it still hit me. Damn, for 200. Yo, bussy coconut. Oh, guys, gonna go. He's going crazy. He's going crazy. Ah, oh, ran right into. It. I should have stopped walking. Whatever, you're dead. Stay in one spot. What, boy? All right, this one has a lot more health. Fucking, I love the music in this game. Back to the elevator. We go. Drew Dog, since you're new to the channel, I'll tell this story one more time. So when I was younger, my cousin Kevin, who was the one that put me onto all these great, amazing games, he came over and he brought over Final Fantasy VII for us to play. And uh, he, he was staying over for the weekend. He came on like a Friday. So we thought, we're like, yo, we'll try to beat this game during the whole weekend. We didn't get close. We didn't even get through disc one throughout the whole weekend. And... Um, I was like, damn, when he left, I was like, shit, I really wanted to, uh, I really want to play this game. So I asked my mom, I was like, you know, can we, uh, can we go get Final Fantasy? I didn't know it was called Final Fantasy VII. So at that time, Final Fantasy VIII, I guess, was the newest one. So we went to, we went to, um, Swap Shop by me, where we used to buy games. And we got Final Fantasy VIII. And I didn't know. I got home, I put it on, and I'm like, none oh, of this looks familiar. Where's Cloud? Who the hell is Squall? <laughs> I was so scared to tell- I didn't tell my mom anything. She did not know about this information that she bought me the wrong game. Because Lord knows if I told her that, she would have beat the brakes off me. But I played through 8. I didn't get that far in it. And then later that week, my cousin ended up beating FF7 and he wanted to play 8, so we traded. So I borrowed his FF7 to play. But I ended up loving FF8. I actually did the uh, primal liquid guide on um, how to get the how to get Squall's final weapon on disc one, and it was like super funny. So when we play FF8 on stream here, I'll definitely be doing that to start it off. Show you guys how we can get crazy OP. Floor forty guys. 
We are less than halfway there. Here, I got like tons of tools. I don't think it matters. Like, you gotta see in my storage back at the police station, I got like 70 tools. So regardless, I'm throwing away whatever. I don't care. Yeah, I have the remastered FF8, which I'd love to restart and play back for you guys. Dun, 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 dun. Drop off this stuff. Yo, Mojo! What's going on, my dude? Shout out to Mojo in the chat for blessing us with his presence, my dude. Yeah, I like Final Fantasy 9. It was the first Final Fantasy where, like, the main character was actually likable. I, I like Cloud, and I just thought he was cool, but I mean, what I mean by that is, like, not like a depressed, mopey character. <laughs> Lord knows Squall and Cloud were exactly that. Oops. Oops. Is that all? Yeah. It is. By the way, do I need to key? <sighs> How do, do I have to keep all the keys? I really wish I could drop that off. Remove this. Look at all them tools and cards. Let's mosey. Sid Howen. Nope, just keep the highest level key. Okay, gotcha, Kyrus. Thank you. Let me go back and do that. Squall and Renoa. The most unlikely and unrealistic story ever. Do you guys like that uh, Squall is dead theory? I feel like I really enjoy that theory a lot and it gives me goosebumps. How do you, how do you guys feel about that? I know the, I know the uh, developers at Square don't like that theory, but I want to know what you guys think about it. There's even a website called squallisdead.com that really goes into detail about that theory and explains why. Yeah, to be honest, Cloud is like just, you know, a 16-year-old mindset, and he's just, all he's thinking about is Tifa's cheeks. How can he clap him? How can he, how can he look cool in front of Tifa? But the dumb idiot doesn't realize he's already in there, man. He's already in there. He's got no face in the end. He's got a hole in his face. And they never explain his icicle injury. Yeah, for real. They just use a cure three on him. Yeah, when you guys get a chance, look at the check out the squallisdead.com and look at look all about the theory and let me know. Oh, uh, Drew Dog, I don't know if you have already. Please uh, join our Discord, man. We got to shout that out. Uh, guys, can you link the Discord in the chat? Our Discord community is filled with a bunch of amazing individuals. Mostly everybody you already see here on the live stream. It's the best way to keep in contact with us. I have it on my phone, so you could always, like, we, I'm always, I'm really active on it. I'm like, always on there, so if you ever have a question, I'm always there to answer it for you guys. And all that stuff. Thank you, Derek. I appreciate that. Thank you, Renee. 
Oh yeah, Drew. Trust me. Like uh, Discord, I started using it just just because I like you know I wanted to have a place for all of us to keep in touch, man. And it's transformed into this amazing community, and I just I'm super proud of it. I'm super thankful. Love all you guys. When um uh when uh Drew Dog joins, can somebody assign him a uh, the newbie role so this way he can see all the the rest of the the threads and stuff. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Thank you. Three thousand BP. What should I use it on? Damage. Don't need the damage. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna use it on 180 TV. Let's get that 60 going. Omega, what's up, man? Uh, we'll play Xenogears after Metal Gear, which won't take me long to go through because I am a world class speedrunner at Metal Gear Solid. And after that, we'll do Xenogears. But after this game, we're going to be running into Parasite Eve 2. That's going to be on Friday. Oh, yeah, for sure, Darren. Oh, show. I think I had to go right. Right, and then down. You're a musher. Yeah, Xenogears, is, it's going to be my very first time playing Xenogears, so I'm very excited to playing it, and uh, I, what goes without saying, you know, no spoilers. Um, gameplay spoilers is okay. Brandon Valdez, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Happy to have you here, my dude. If you are here in the live chat, say what's up one time. When do you stream days and time? So normally, Omega, I don't normally stream on Wednesdays. I stream on Tuesday at 8 p.m. and Friday at 8 p.m. Eastern. Eastern time. That's right. Mojo is right. Don't spoil Xenogears. Or you're going to get cheeks clapped. You're getting clapped. I only ever played the Xenogears demo disc from Parasite Eve. Yo, that's sick. All right, what song is going to be playing on this floor now? Let's see. Oh, I like this song. After you finish Xenogears, I'm going to start streaming FF9. Hey! I'm going to try to actually increase how many times I stream so this way I can like finish games a little bit quicker because I do... I do obviously want to go back and play some games because on our list we do have plans to return back to God of War and Spider-Man and of course play Miles Morales and all that stuff which will be out on the PS5 when that's here. Um, so I most likely will replay it on the PS5, of course. But we do have plans to replay those games. World of Final Fantasy is good. Is that like the mobile game? It's an enemy! An enemy! An enemy! An enemy! An enemy! There you go. But like... Actually felt like Nemo there. Couldn't say shit. Bro, that's so broken. The hit stun from those four shots already gives me my ATB bag. That's crazy. But if you increase your streams, when will I stream? Because I can't stream and watch. Uh, <laughs> just let me know your schedule, man. And I'll see what I can do. It's because of football, really. Football is kind of messing up our schedule. Because I like to watch, you know, games on Sunday, Thursday, and uh, Monday. So, I mean, those days, I use, I used to stream on... Uh, I used to stream sometimes on Sunday, and I would stream on Mondays. It used to be Mondays, Tuesdays, and then Friday.
Is Final Fantasy Type-0 a good game? I have it. I bought it because it came with a demo for Final Fantasy 15, and I never actually played through Type-0. I still have it here. It's like basically brand new. It's insane. But I've never played it, but it's the only Final Fantasy with a mature rating, I believe, right? World of Final Fantasy is a Final Fantasy game on consoles. Nice. I would love to play 14. Final Fantasy 14, I love that game so much, and I would love to return and just get back into the end game with you guys. If you guys want to join the stream, of course. But I'll have to balance playing with you guys and playing with my uh, cousins because that's my team, man. You guys can watch us play. I mean, Dragoon and Samurai. I definitely want to level up a monk. I used to be a paladin tank, but tanking kind of bored me in that game, so I like fell off of it. But I love doing DPS in that game. Just run shit over with a with a samurai? Hell yeah. And then like dragoons became insanely good when Shadowbringers came out. Main dragoon and samurai in Final Fantasy 14. Crazy. Frog. Frog. Yeah, because in World of Warcraft, you used to be able to, uh, like, just put on some damage, tank, tank, taunt, and then once you build up your meter, you can pretty much look away and just, you know, not worry about shit. Whereas in Final Fantasy, it doesn't matter how much enmity you build up. It's constantly like flowing and you gotta worry about the healers pulling aggro and all that crazy stuff too. It's more engaging, I'll give you that. The tanking in, in 14 is way more engaging than it is in other games, but it's not fun. <laughs> I just feel like it's a chore sometimes. I do like the gunbreaker. I made a gunbreaker and I was thinking of leveling it up, which I thought was kind of cool because he wields a gun blade and I'm like, how the hell is this a tank? I don't know, but they were making it work. It was like a DPS hybrid tank. Somebody was talking about Jade Cocoon, and uh, I remember Isaac was talking about that as well. Is this floor 41 now? Yeah. Whatever you do as a gunbreaker, don't accidentally hit Super Bolide by accident. <laughs> Ever play as Blue Mage? I haven't played as Blue Mage, but my cousin told me all about it. It's like, you know, offline story solo type of a gameplay because too broken to actually be a uh, playable character online. Damn it, he's gonna die. Ooh. Lower defense, shit. Right, let's use some of those items. Yeah, like, I would, I would just get bored uh, tanking in 14. This wasn't for me. Yeah, it's capped at 60 because of the... I knew it was too good to be true. I'm like, what? We already got to 41? It's too good to be true. Do, 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 do. What type of healer do you use, Nogandis? Do you use uh, Astrology? Or white mage. Scholar and white mage. 
White mages are super good for certain boss mechanics. Because uh, they can just burn through heals. Like, it's great. I just poisoned a poisoner. Yeah, yeah. That's pretty much how blue mages work, Tracy. With enemy skills. I wonder if Sid will play like Jack. So if Sid plays like a straight up Dragoon, I'm happy. I'm there. Like I started off like my first DPS character in 14 was a Dragoon and then I transitioned to a uh, Samurai. And then I started playing as both, but I mastered Samurai first. And like recently for Shadowbringers, I don't, there's a new rotation obviously for every character, but the new rotation for a Dragoon, I gotta like, re I gotta, I gotta learn and master that. <laughs> Blue Mage, show me your moves. Literally, show me your moves. Taking them shits. The mind move now. Give me the snoo snoo. Reload, damn it. No, seriously, show me your moves. I'm trying to learn them. What? This is very good. The bee suit. Damn. That's really good. I just put that on now. I have super tools, right? Or did I drop off the super tools? Uh, actually, I have one tool. I don't need the super tool for that. A monster. One of my cousins who's... The only MMO he likes is uh, DC Universe Online. I told him to play as a samurai just so it'd be easy for him to pick up and play. But my cousin told him about how overpowered and strong like, summoners were. And it turned him off from the game and I felt bad about that. Like he just he just didn't enjoy the game. And he just completely stopped playing with us. And I'm like, damn. You should have told him to play as a different character, man. Why you give him something? Like, why you give him, like summoners are a little bit more challenging to play as. Compared to what he's used to, you know? Super Tool was my nickname in high school. It was not a compliment. <laughs> not my boy. Oh, that's not that good. Status stuff is really cool, but... You lose a lot of shit. I mean, I could just do this. the bee jacket put on the bee suit and take I already have that poison would be good I think we're just gonna go with poison get rid of that poison yeah DC Universe Online was so much fun man I love how broken the like, healers and shit were doing crazy damage because of how good your skill points could be and if you like you got all the achievements you can allocate skill points into every stats and basically overload your DPS while healing which is so cool creative as fuck man I really I really hope for like PS5 and next gen DC Universe like does something to come back or like rework itself because I really do think it's an underrated MMO it's a great game like, they gotta redo their models, of course, and, like, you know, fix up their graphics and shit like that, but... Dude, the game's good. I like I like DC Universe Online. It's an MMO that I, I do find myself returning back to many times over the years. Hey, no worries, Drew Dog. Leviathan, what's up, man? How hype are the Monster Hunter players for the Monster Hunter movie? <laughs> is it a movie? A Monster Hunter movie? Not like live action, is it? Yeah, white mages are always in demand, man. They're just the best healers. Oh, spare yourself? Okay.
Kill this fucking frog. All right. Day less. Oh, he's in the air. I thought, that, I thought that Dune movie got pushed back a little bit, too. Yeah, it's taking us a lot longer after floor 40 to, like, find the uh, steps. I think we're on 43 now. Yo, what's up, Shane? Poison fam. What you gonna do when you're looking stupid? You're fighting that sleep, Drew? Fighting that sleep with us all. I'm mostly sure the, high, the higher floors become bigger since less gates are down. Shite. We've come too far. Yeah, I'm finishing this regardless. Got to. This is the dead end. Should have known better. Watch this be a dead end too. And I'm like, damn, I should have known better. And it's not. Man, turn left or right or some shit. And of course I get both. I'll go right first. Elevator. And dead end. Knew it! I knew it! We're almost at 90 likes, guys. If you haven't yet, hit that like button. We're almost there be sure to subscribe so you don't miss when we go live for parasite eve 2 after we finish this live stream it's not gonna go live tonight of course i mean we're gonna play that on friday damn it it's floors I need crack at the best in town. Crack kills, my friend. Crack kills. It would suck if this building was really structured this way in real life. Yeah, I wonder. I wonder if you can go up and inside the Chrysler building as like a tourist. Like, what's it like? And people always go to the Empire State, or they go to uh, the New World Trade. The New World Trade is pretty cool because they got a bar up there. Empire State's boring because there is no bar. Dodge your way. Yo, X across the ass. I know. I might, I, need, I might need to go grab a snack real quick. I need something to munch on. This, yo, this fucking shit doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I was thinking, I don't think these engineers understood how the elevators are meant to work. Yeah, the frog is a dragoon in this game. To lean back, fix my posture. There we go. Ah, yes. My back feels lovely. Oh, God. I feel like this is a dead end. It's not. What? There's no way. Three vertical paths in a row? Let's just keep going vertical. 
I do have some popcorn. Good grab. Oh! Yes! Did it! It's 44 now. What is your idea, War Angel? I close somebody to the top. We're 45, so we're less than halfway. The SAR? Or the SAR? Less than halfway, my bad. More than halfway. A podcast? I'm always interested in podcasts. 33 floors to the top. 33. Medicine too, just cause. Looking forward to that mojo. You got the mojo. He go all the way over there. Shit. Oh my god. Targeting these fools. Can't get them to all line up. Damn, their ATB is schmoving. Eh, I'll take them all. I don't know why it took so long for me to figure that out. Let's use two medicine twos. Don't you dare do this to I or Breer. I or Breer. One of my favorite episodes of the Powerpuff Girls was when Mojo Jojo took over Bubbles' brain and her voice actor had to imitate his speech patterns. It was hilarious. Mojo Jojo. Show was funny. Wasn't it uh, Tara Strong that did Bubbles? Bro, she is legendary. Tara Strong's done like almost every character, I swear. A target? Oh! Hit me with that jump! He said, I ain't a dragoon, I'm dragging these nuts on your head. That's what he said. Oh, next floor up. Yo, this is the fastest floor that we've gotten on floor 40. We're getting lucky. Yo, Tara Strong is actually pretty hot, too. You ever see a picture of her, man? She got uh, the materials. 
favorite materials are purple. Damn, that reload. Oh, this is gonna hurt. What that lick? Tara Strong was also Timmy Turner from the Fairly Odd Parents. Recommended to remove the times to fire. Oh, so much work though, man. What's up, Chong, by the way? Hitting him with them juggle combos, War Angel. You were deadlifting 500 pounds, Mojo. Were you grunting? This is a, what do they call it? The lunk alarm? It's a judgment-free zone. Slamming them weights. He set off their lunk alarm. No. What is your least play least favorite playable Final Fantasy character ever? Mine is Kate Sith. Yeah, it's Kate Sith. Without a doubt. Can I just enter these? Oh, you still need a key. Wow, really? Dead end here? All right, so this elevator is on the right side. Are you sure? Okay, shit. Ooh. That character sucks. that shit really wish there was a fucking phone in these uh storage closets man more pe please thank you okay thank you i got a super tool got that super tool super tool You got this, bro. I believe in you. Let me know on Discord if you need any help. Hey. Oh, you're talking to, talking to Darren. I got you. <laughs> I was like, Emojo, you got the skill? You got you got the stuff on deck to, to zoom past this part? With this many floors in this building, you would think there'd be a map. All right, next up floor. That's all good, Mojo. Uh, is this it? What are we on? 47? Do-do-do-do-do-do Boy, you getting your cheeks slammed
I'm gonna make sure to heal a lot during these boss fights because I would hate to fucking die and have to redo a whole 10 floors, man. That's just scary. Terrifying. It's terrifying. Charles Barkley. Knew it. Cloud, Tifa, and Barrett just work well together. They do. The capacity at? Yo, 24? Dang, we got, we got, got them bullets! Damn it. So this was a uh, kind of a waste on this side. We gotta walk back and go south. Yeah, Vincent is the man in having children. Vincent, Red 13, and Cloud were my main teams growing up. Was my main team growing up. But for Remake 2, it's definitely going to be Tifa, Red 13, and Cloud. Sprinkle some Barret in there. Sorry, Aerith. I mean, I'll play I'll play as Aerith, of course. I'm going to give her some love whenever she needs it. But, you know, I'm just saying that open world is Tifa, you know? <laughs> we are still streaming, Anthony. What's up, man? Train ain't stop until we... Finish this. I love using Vincent even with his not so great limits. Yeah, his limits sucked. Especially when he came across an enemy that he actually healed. But his limit breaks, that was frustrating. Chris, what's up, man? Hope work was well for you, my dude. Okay, I don't know how many more floors we got, but I'm pretty sure we're above 45 at this point. We're definitely above 45. Boy, you gonna lick my ass like that? Have you lost your mind? Cause I help you find it. Man, not targetable. I'm getting stuck in these, uh... I'm getting frozen. Hold on. Worst board game, in your opinion? Trivial's, trivial Pursuit. I can say that with confidence. Dudes and ladders? What about eels and escalators from Spongebob? <laughs> escalators, escalators, escalators! Eels! Trivial Pursuit. <laughs> fun when we were younger i was wondering if uh like you know how like among us is like sparking this like murder mystery genre i wonder if clue could somehow make a comeback and kind of do like something similar you know that that among us is doing what do you guys think uh, maybe i just leaked a really good idea and they're watching the stream right now and somebody's gonna come up with it and it's gonna make millions of dollars and i'm gonna be very upset about that
Yeah, Trivial Pursuit is uh, very underwhelming. Me and my girlfriend, we have it, and it's like, eh. And then you got like, you know, you got Taboo, which is also fun to play, but then you can download charades on your phone and choose the most coolest categories of any show, movie, whatever it is you want to you want to answer questions on with charades. So it's like, damn, why even try Taboo then? Secret Hitler. Hitler. Yeah. Yo, what the? Who you licking, motherfucker? I whoop your ass. Queef is a great game, too, if anyone's ever played it. <laughs> Quelve. You be queefing, my dude? What about Among Us? Uh, no, I was just saying, like, the game Clue, the board game Clue. They can make a comeback and basically copy the concept of Among Us being a murder mystery game. And basically make like a board game murder mystery thing kind of like Among Us. But with clues like twists and turns and all that stuff. I'm <laughs> oh, sorry, Mojo. I was like, my dude about that queef life. <laughs> The music stops. I look to my left, and my cheeks are getting clapped. A monster! Oh no! Don't do it! Don't do it! I'm scared! Slap! Oh. Damn, 284 that time? Fucking damn! Hit me with some damn dams right there. Oh, gotta reload! I'm always scared whenever she has to reload. All right, that dude got stronger. Cheeks are getting clapped by Congo. Oh my God. That is the scariest person to get your cheeks clapped by. The R suit, damn. Really, base 65, ATB down, but he can remove that with a super tool. Damn, I might put this shit on. Hold on a sec. Hold up. Wait a minute. Wait a minute, motherfucker. I do these, and then I do, uh, you know, I, I do uh, these, I do that. Uh, then I do a of these over. Duh, you know what I'm saying? I do lose the darkness and, you know, the thing, but still, it's pretty nice. A lot of PE energy. Did I do it? What do you guys think? You might be able to make it so you don't have to reload, I think, by using the ammo box out of combat. Ah, oh, but still, man, it's just so much menu. But I'll, I'll start. I'll start trying to do it. I wonder if this is worth it. HP max. I will lose the darkness and anti poison, and I will be gaining ten more defense. Uh... Those tricep dips were crazy, Mojo. It's the art suit. The art suit. Yeah, I'm not gonna do it. We ain't gonna do it. I think I'm good. Peter. Did I come from the right or left? Fuck, I always forget. If you were to make a board game based off of Final Fantasy VII, what concepts, what concepts would it have? I'd make a trading card game like Triple Triad. I would love that, man. Can Square come out with a Triple Triad, like actual game, man? The 
triple trial. Da. Did I just go in a circle? Let me see. Is this a circle if I go up here to the right? Let me see. Might have to go south. But are they good though, Tracy? Are they good? That is the question. Next question. I've already been in here. I'm in a circle. I gotta go back down. Suck my ass. I think on the next boss, I'm gonna use Liberate. To be uh be on the safe side, so I ain't trying to get my cheeks clapped. You know what I'm saying? To build up some PE energy first. Actually, it's gonna take forever to kill these fuckers, so I might as well just start blasting now. Where you going, motherfucker? Ah, I'm gonna take all. Well, one of your characters are cards. It's like, I love Triple Triad in Final Fantasy XIV. I love how you can get the heroes of Final Fantasy as cards to play as, and they're like rare and stuff like that, and you can unlock them. And I love Final Fantasy XIV. I think it's a great game. Absolutely. I right, start going south. We'll win the cards by playing actual triple triad. I'm gonna try to download it and play it. Is it a, is it a Japanese only app? Like, do I have to get the APK for it? I'll be back. Says Mojo. Mojo. Yeah, I gotta try it out. Okay, I think we are. This might be floor 50. Think so? That's funny, uh, Anthony. I actually don't like Gwent, but I like Triple Triad more. I gotta like sit there and like try to understand Gwent, cause I know I normally I like card games. Like card games are fun to me, uh, but Gwent was just it was weird to pick up in the game, and I was just at a point where I'm like, ah, oh, I don't care to learn this shit. But there is a Gwent app now, and I downloaded it, but I didn't play it because it fucking used so much memory. I had to, had to delete it. I didn't like the card game on 9. I don't remember what the card game was in Final Fantasy 9. Somebody was talking about it the other day. Like, why couldn't they eat Triple Triad in Final Fantasy 9? Why they had to do something different? I remember there was a card game. But I don't remember what the rules were or, like, what it, consist what it consisted of. Oh, God. I was like, yo, we just got this floor. Are we already out here? Are we already out this bitch? And nope. We ain't. Am I the only one who likes Nine's card game? <laughs> Neglandis, I'm not sure. <laughs> it's fairly similar to a Triple Triad. I gotta see what exactly it is, because I, I, honestly, I can't remember it. As you're walking to the floors, just think, ooh, piece of candy. Yes. Wait, did I use Medicine 4 just now by accident? I thought 2 was only get 60. But that wasn't the case. Elevator, elevator. Hey, 
Yeah, Anthony, uh, the XP you're getting in this area sucks. Like, not anything to level up off of. Like, really, the best place to level up is in the museum. We are still 35. Yes. Man, stop licking me. Stop doing the lickety split. The USP3 solid snake in this bitch. I went down last time, so let me go up. Lee, have a great night, man. Thanks for hanging out with us for so long, dude. Is this it? Are we through? Yes, we are. Go. All right. Is this the 50th floor? I think it is. I have a good feeling it might have been. Nope. Music didn't change. Well, then, fuck me. I don't know. <laughs> Five boxes. Oh my god. Fence. A rocket. Yeah, my man. Whoa, whoa. The CM armor better. I gotta check. I gotta check via the tool. Let me see. Do the stats comparison. Click on this and then click on that. 52, 55, 37. Nope. It ain't better. It's got different effects though. He uses cure to remove status and uses medicine when HP is low. See you later, Flea. I already said bye, Flea. My bad. What if I did this? Oh, yeah. I don't have a... I use a trading card to expand it. Elijah Augustine, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Hope all is well with you, man. What's up, Christian? Guess what? I didn't watch uh, Dead Fantasy. My bad, dude. Before you ask again. <laughs> and then Christian leaves. My bad, man. We're doing the end game right now for Parasite Eve 1. We're just trying to get to uh, floor 77. Right now we're on 49, I want to say. Uh, did I come from this way? Fuck. I forget about this shit. You got engaged last week, Christian? Yo, congrats, dude. That's fucking amazing. Yo, shoutouts to Christian in the chat, guys. He just recently got engaged, man. That is amazing to hear, my dude. You know what? In your in that, from you saying that, I will definitely have to watch uh, Dead Fantasy. So you are not depressed. It's not a moment for you to be depressed. So I I will watch Dead Fantasy tonight when I go lay in bed. Can't have this man depressed after being engaged, man. Congrats. That's a that's fucking awesome, man. I will watch it in your honor. Josh, my dude. Oh, fuck. Knew it was too good to be true going that way. Go this way. I hope you do believe me when I tell you you won't be disappointed. And thank you. Of course, man. I know for a fact, I mean, we have a lot of, like, ever since we used to, like, you know, we chat at work and stuff. I always knew you had, like, very similar tastes in, like, media as me. 
which is really cool. I remember if I asked, you're still in Florida, right? Like you're still you're still in South Florida, Christian? Wasn't sure if you moved or not. Cool. Are oh, you moving next year? Gotcha. Whoa. Tree varieties in here? Kill this fucking bird. And it's hitting the frog. Let's go. Damn it. I targeted the wrong one. Oh, dodged him. Let's go. Oh, I'm good, man. Oh, you're talking to Renee, my bad. <laughs> Big PP energy. Leviathan. That is all we got on this channel. Big PP energy. Oh. Wow. Let's go right, because uh, I just got a feeling it might be right. Keep choosing poorly. And, oh, wait a second. Could I be absolutely right? Oi, governor. What's going on here? We got triple, triple horizontal hallways. Oh, is this it? Of course not. Of course not. Horse dick. What's my next game? Next game after this is Parasite Eve 2. After we finish Parasite Eve 1. Which uh, apparently is shorter than... Oh my god, really? So this whole side is incorrect. Fuck. Which uh, Parasite Eve 2 is apparently shorter than Parasite Eve 1. Which is interesting. Hey, Neji, I love having you here as well, my dude. So we gotta go up the north path. North is the way to go. My Final Fantasy 8 team? I always had Zell on there. It's definitely Squall, Zell. Uh, I wanna say Quistus? Quistus or Selfie? I didn't care for Renoa and I didn't care for uh, Irvine. What? This whole area? This whole area is wrong? Are you? Why would you even make me come here? Dude, look at this place. This place sucks. I'm so thankful that the music changes every 10 floors. So it's like, you don't go crazy in this game for hearing the same songs over and over again. I can't believe they made me walk all the way here for nothing. I'm about to go get some Oreos, man. That's what I'm waiting for. I'm waiting to get to floor 50 so we can go save, get some Oreos, refill up on some water. It's slightly shorter if you view it in a single playthrough, but the multiple difficulties make it much more replayable. Well, I'll only be playing uh, Parasite Eve one, uh, Parasite Eve two once. I won't be uh, I won't be going for any of that extra stuff. I don't remember which way. No new game plus in uh, Parasite Eve two for me. Favorite fictional weapon top three. Oh, the Buster Sword is up there. Kratos's blades. Maybe Thor's hammer, Mjolnir? Mjolnir! Oh god, 
God, don't tell me I came from here. I went all the way back. Ah, oh. my God. The Chrysler Tower is as long as a normal game almost. I actually think it's a little bit longer, believe it or not. Yeah, I know. I want them Oreos, man. You play Parasite Eve 2 first, so you like it more than this one. That's cool. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Dude, okay. So, okay. So, what mistake did I make here? Am I supposed to go north on the next window? God, these upper floors suck, dude. Do I want to be on this till 3? Uh, 1 a.m. by me right now. Left and up. What about here, Leviathan? I think up here. Oh, let's go left. See. Now, when I think of Irvine, I think of him as a cowboy. God damn, I'm talking like this. I can't make the shout. Oh, what was me? Uh, a weird city cowboy. <laughs> Oh god, yes. Please be floor 50. Man, we gotta take our t we gotta be careful with this boss because I ain't trying to die. Come on, is this 50? It is not! Holy shit! Wow! Wow! Oh my god! Wow! Iron Breer. Actually, I'll take all. Actually, I can't take all. Wow. Wow. You called it, Leviathan. we just been climbing and climbing and climbing up dumb cheeks. Bring your motherfucking ass here. You licked me, you scunt. You licked me too! Fuck! Alright, just have to kill one. Yeah, I get hit by that. Oh! Alright, let's use those uh, med twos one time while we're at it. You're good at dodging! <laughs> it depends. Guess that was not good. Those frogs. This is not good. Not good at all. Just keep soaking it. Just keep soaking it. This is the worst case of the bully bully I've ever seen in my life. Nothing at all. Just keep soaking it. I love Cursed Cowardly Dog. That doctor. Dr. Vindolo. Yo, we're almost at 90 likes, guys. Thank you. 88. We hit that magical one hundo. Will I ever make it to the top of this tower? Find out in the next episode of Dr. Shoals Z. Her feet are killing her. Bro, whoever thought whoever thought of this this being an endgame? Oh my god. I'm gonna slap him. I'm gonna go back to Square Enix and slap him. Stupid dog! You make me look bad. Ooga booga booga! Right, I'm gonna try left first. When you go, when you branch off and then it just unwinds into some absolute bullshit, that's just when it gets me and it's like, damn, man. Come on. Enemy fight. Oh, 
Oh, what? Wasn't in range of him? I love how the doctor's always making up shit. This is the worst case of the chicken box I've ever seen in my life. And it's like she, she has a demon inside of her. She needs to be exercised. And he's like, this is the worst case of the chicken box I've ever seen. You can't slap square Enix, just slap square soft. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a slap him. I'm a slap him square hard. I want them damn Oreos, man. Damn it. Boga, boga, boga. Ah! I love how he just randomly mutters. Or my name is Jose, and it's not. No cookies for you. No cookies for me. Boy, I'll eat your ass. I promise. I promise I'll eat your ass, boy. The pillow feels good on my neck. Monster. These dudes hit hard, dude. The last one hit 248, I think. 217. That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. Oh, you jazz, boy. Another monster? Shit. Wow, they actually... I wasn't expecting that. It's always been one monster in a chest every random amount of floors. She got me there. <laughs> Mojo came back to hearing me say I'm gonna eat someone's ass. Boy, I'll eat your ass. With peanut butter. And ranch dressing. And you're gonna like it too. What? They're running low on the Healy Healy's. They call me Ranch because I be dressing. I would use Nutella. Nah, Nutella hides the taste. I want to taste the rank. You got to taste the rank because it makes you a man. I'm making Neji cry. <laughs> Why Ranch dressing though? Because it tastes the same. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, my God. We're getting... <laughs> I'm being penetrated right now. Hold on a sec. That's a lot of damage. How is that hitting both of them? Oh, God. I'm getting hit by this dude on the right. Healy, healy. Let's no feely. I'm fine being a 27 year old child. I don't want to be a man. No rank for me. <laughs> no rank, boy. I found out, uh, honestly, I found out very late in life that uh, certain men have foot fetishes. I didn't know that was a thing. I actually went to a strip club with uh, my cousin and his friends. <gasps> All right, boss is here. Let's make sure we're prepared. This story's gonna have to wait, by the way, guys. Let me fight out. Um, let me get some PE energy up real quick. Let me get into a fight over here. Stories don't have to wait. Actually, I'll tell you a story right now. So we went to a. Okay, there is no enemies. Went to a strip club with my cousin and his friends, and his friends like uncle came with us, and he's a little bit older, and he's like, like he seemed cool at first. But like we're sitting at the strip club and he's like talking about like you know I'm different when it comes to the strip clubs, man. 
I won't be coming here to look at the boobs. I don't look at the ass, the face, none of that. I'd be watching their feet. And I'm like, feet? I was confused. I'm like, wait, you at $50 to come in here to look at feet? Like, nah, yeah, for real, man. You see that feet right there? You can tell she does her foot real good. And she could do things with them feet. And I'm like, what, what things with the feet? And he started, he proceeded to tell me about the things he would like women to do to him with their feet. And I was just, I was in shock. So when I got home later that night, a quick Google search led me to, uh, find out some things and yeah i never hung out with that guy again after that <laughs> never hung out with that man after that i was like all right oh, yeah, i'm done shoot the younger ones i got you my friend this boss scares me now doom doom a fucking cockroach dude scary Oh my god. Let's do haste. Should have used the item there too. Okay, I'm using these medicine fours. Oh, I dodged it. This is disgusting. One of my worst fears. Oh, it's flying. Flying roach. Oh, 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 God. Oh, God. Uh, we're on poison now. Shit. Not doing that much damage though. Oh god, no, 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 no. Oh! Feet only, yes. Okay, we need to focus on this shit. Run for your life! I'm dead. Okay, no, I'm not dead. Okay. The younger one is getting bigger, and I'm scared right now. Should I use? Yo, can I use um? What's it called? Liberate. Can I? Can I like totally use liberate here? Will that like? Will that help? If I use liberate. Will Liberate hit the up target too? Yeah, let's liberate this bitch. All right, come on, let's do it, please. Aya. Destroy these motherfuckers, come on. I can't see how much damage that's doing, but please just keep hitting this dude. 320, okay, that's good, 329 is good. Look at Aya using them feet. Yeah, foot fetishes are weird. Come on. Yo, yo, come on. He's probably dead. Short you can. Oh, I'm so... Uh, oh, no, 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 no. I have lots of revives. I just realized that. Okay, I'm good. I have lots of revives. I forgot revives were a thing. Oh, I'm dead. Fuck. Why does this have so much defense? All right, we got lots of revives. This is probably where we're going to use most of the revives. Yeah, he's too far. It's not going to take effect. I'm scared. Shit. Son of a bitch. All right, all right. Uh, 
Fuck it. I think this will kill it. Yes! All right. You piece of shit! You're fucking dead! Yo, Anthony. This is the, these are the types of shit we had to deal with when we were younger. <laughs> Look at these legs! Yes! Let's fucking go! Oh my god. <laughs> From feet fetishes to that shit, though. Oh my god! That was that was terrifying. <laughs> I fucking hate roaches, bro. <laughs> oh, these flying roaches, man. <laughs> Speaking of feet, stomped as a roach. That was terrifying, yo. I think I used two revives on there and almost all my uh magic. You reminded me of my friend's favorite saying, spread peanut butter on my ass and F me sideways. Remember the boondocks talking about that. Now the peanut butter goes on the inside of my ass and the jelly goes on the outside. I call it a peanut butter and jelly ass fucking sandwich. <laughs> yeah, shoddy shells do have a fan effect, but there was no way I could position myself to consistently hit the both of them. It did hit a few times though, which is really good. Yeah, Chong, you weren't kidding, man. That younger boss is crazy. The liberate. Oh my god. Can you imagine if I didn't uh, do liberate there? Oh my god. Darren, art. Floor 50 is art. Call it a night. Good job, Blitz. Thank you, Darren, for hanging with us for as long as you did, my dude. Should he use haste to dodge? Bro, I was scared. I used haste like in the beginning, I think, and I just forgot about it after that. I said, fuck it. Ooh, man. Let's get out of here. Save. And then continue this quest. I gotta remember where the hell the elevator is at. Let's save. Get myself some Oreos. Are you up on some water? Damn roaches, man. That's how big they are in Florida, by the way. Some flying roaches. Just be thankful they're not scorpions. Oh, yeah, and like in Arizona, you guys got scorpions to deal with. That's some scary shit. If a scorpion was like in my house right now, I would say, stay over there. <laughs> I'm so funny. I don't care about no little kids. I want that man, but I like you and I want you. Now we can do this the easy way. We can do this the hard way. The choice is yours, Tom. Oh, Tom! I'm coming for that booty, Tom. Booty is more important than escape. Booty is more important than water. Scorpions? Jesus. You got hit by scorpions? See, some people tell me to look at a girl's feet to see if I have a foot fetish. I just mind my own business. Somebody, now that I'm older, somebody tell me some shit like that, I'm gonna smack the shit out of them. Boy, what the hell wrong with you? I see what we're gonna have to do the hard way. <laughs> Let's see what's uh see our trash see our suit maybe see our suit it is better all across the board and then remove the at v down i think that's what i'm gonna do Go CR suit. Swap this for that. Take the stutes. We're gonna take the stutes right here. Use that. Am I right? Am I right? Am I doing it, governor? Governor, am I doing it right? It's gotta process the information. Ah! I 
I see we have to do this the hard way. <laughs> Yeah, we got a lot of rare trading cards. How do you use them? You just got to give it to them or you got to actually use them, use them. Because we got a lot of shit this dude is holding for us. Let's see. So I got to give him it, right? Tune, tune up. This one's a one of a kind card. Can add a slot no way you can add more slots to this can you actually add more slots to this or what, what does this do i'm not gonna risk it hold on let me uh let me store some shit If a female puts her foot on your thigh when you're younger, you might get a foot fetish. Them feet. Two slots on top of the four that I have right now? That's possible? I didn't even know that. Let me save the game before I make any crazy changes. Even though I already did my armor. Oh wait, I put the armor away. I just noticed that. I didn't have it equipped. It's all the way down here. The M8000 max is five slots. I want to go to jail. I want to go to jail and get anally raped. No worries, Renee. We're definitely going to be on. We got a lot left to cover in this game. Jesus Christ, that roach, man. That was a scary fight. That fire, though. Oh, my God. Shit was hitting. All right, I'll be right back, guys. Don't you guys go anywhere. We're still, pl we're still playing this. We're trying to finish this up tonight. Don't go anywhere, guys. I'm going to grab some snacks, some more water. You guys chat with each other oh my leg
Get on. You guys ever took an Oreo? Opened it up and dipped it in uh, peanut butter? Like Jif peanut butter? It's amazing. Four fifty. It is amazing indeed. Yes, sir, Tracy. got 27 left There's nothing wrong with having a foot fetish. Totally 100%. Fine. It's just kind of weird if you spent $50 to get into a strip club just to look at feet, though. That's where I kind of got to... I think you have a problem. Thank you guys for making this end game so much more enjoyable my god i don't even know if my cousin actually even finished this i can't imagine Eagle? 10 slots is a pistol, my god. Three hundred junk. A lot of junk in the trunk. That's a grind in itself. The AM44, I think I have that one. So you think I should um, switch to the AM44, Chong? Transfer everything from the M8000 over to the M44, the AM44? Alright, let's do it. Oreo so good.
What's DDO? McFever? The regular Oreo, Chris. I've never been a fan of the mega stuff or the double the double stuff Oreos. It's this I don't know. Tastes different. I ain't about that laugh. <laughs> regular cookie, regular cookie emoji. Oh, the vanilla Oreo, Mojo. Oh, that was so good. I got peanut butter stuck in the roof of my mouth. Let's go look at the AM44. Pistachio Oreos. What? I had a, for the first time in forever, I bought some Chips Ahoy. And I finished them so fast, I was mad at myself. Like, why didn't I let it last? Why'd I do this to myself? Let's find the AM44 and beef that bitch up. There we go. Anything else? Now let's take all these items we need. I take some med kits too. Okay, use some of these crazy trading cards. The ones with the cool names. Of course, a super tool. Yes. I don't even know if I need all this shit. I'm just bringing them over. All right. Now it's some focus time. Don't want to mess this up. Oh, the AM44 is 78, 58, 12, and this is 57, 58, 12. Nice. So how exactly, I forget, how exactly do I transfer this over properly without messing it up? Do I have to talk to him? Maybe I can open the stats up first. Let me see. Get my trading card. Go to the AM44. Add a sloop. Here you go. Nothing do it. Nothing do it. Wait, did I just use it? That was weird. I or breer. So there should be six slots on this weapon, and there's eight max, I think. Yeah, I'm using the cards with the names on it. 
Dungeons and Dragons Online. Cool. Mamma mia. And there we go. Eight slots on this bitch. Give me that tweak. We can tweak it off that TCP, huh? This is why you fuck with me, huh? Match, we gonna end up on TV, huh? I can see the spirits all around me. All right, so now I'm just I'm gonna go save and do this next to the phone just so I don't fuck it up. That would be very sad if I like destroyed my weapon. So we got eight slots available on the AM44. So what we're gonna do is we're going to transfer stats and other bonuses. Excuse me, from our existing gun to that one. Then we might as well use some BP to beef it up even more. Yeah, vanilla soft serve ice cream is amazing, dude. Love vanilla soft serve ice cream, especially in New York. The Mr. Softy machines. Oh my God. Oh, Mr. Softy uh, truck. Dev Kumar, what's up, man? How you doing, dude? I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Dave. JPEG Mafia? I think I've heard of it. All right, let's try this out now. So we're going to go to tune up. I'm going to click on the AM, click on the pointy bits. Try this out. I'm going to take the double commands. Let's go with double commands. Super tool it. It works exactly like that. Okay. Well, I didn't need to use a super tool on the poison. I already have a poison thingy. Whatever. Okay, we're gonna get more super tools anyways. shots does this have only two shots i think i think it is soft serve ice cream dipped in chocolate have you ever had that no i did not ditch the times two all right we'll ditch it all right so let's switch over the base remind you of the pointy bits video <laughs> All right. Damn, that damage. 152. We'll probably get that to 180 with how much BP we have right now. Nice, Chong. Nice. Yeah, times two, those multipliers do cut damage in half. But double commands is cool. I like that. Uh, maybe I should remove... I think it's to remove the ATB down off of this suit. Ah, I hate to shoot. Let me, uh, let me get all armor so I can remove. Did I remove ATB down stat? Is it that much of a uh, inconvenience? Mario, thank you so much, man. I appreciate you joining my dude. Everything is fine with me, man. I hope everything is fine with you and your family. You're turning 40, Mario? Yo, congrats. Happy birthday to Mario, guys. Flood the chat.
Thank you. Click on this. Okay, yeah, it works. Mm, plus two inventory, though. That's pretty good. Yo, thank you so much for the $5, Mario. I appreciate that, dude. That is super generous of you, man. Especially on your birthday, my man. Hope you enjoy the rest of your birthday. Hey, thanks for the emojis too, man. And thank you everybody for shouting out Mario on his birthday, dude. Alright, now I gotta take some... Hey, I got some healing items from this man. Oh, really? I only have two medicine threes. Another tool just in case. There were some medicine twos in here. I might just take those just... Just to have them. While we find more medicine threes and fours. Remember to equip the new gun. I didn't? Let me see. Oh yeah, because it destroyed it. Boom. Where did that? And the armor is on. That's right. So much space. All right, let's go save the game and continue. The DDO online? Sure. I love MMOs. Alright guys, back to the mission at hand. Here's the goddamn floors! We should be getting medicine 4s and 3s as a regular now, which is good. We'll be using those medicine 2s quite often now. Also, our defense is stupid good right now, and our damage? My Jesus! I love double commands. I think that's a really clutch, uh, clutch stat booster attribute effect. Ting, 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 ting. Didn't realize it was going. Elevator's fast, by the way. Just want 50 floors like that? Your ears pop? 
Now we gotta go right. Fifty one to sixty has the best OST. Let's check it out. I already went here. Why am I doing this? You mean using the elevator as a pain to go up to the upper floors? Hell yeah. I hate this place. This place sucks. But I'm challenging myself to complete it. Regardless if the revelation or the end game is ass, I still want to do it. I want to do it. Straight up, and we're here. Next floor. Hear this song, come on, it's good. What's the song? What's the song? What's the song? Oh, I love this song. Yes. This song is really good. Do -do 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 -do. Oh my god, that damage. Yeah, their damage is crazy. I like this part with the piano. I like the part when the piano is going fast and like dun 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 I see how much XP am I getting if it's enough to hit them levels, man, because Jesus. They brought us down to half health in that fight. We're almost at a hundred likes, guys. Thank you, everybody. If you're having to hit that like button. Let's keep it going. All right, 51, 51. You guys keeping track? Was that 51 or is this 52? Or is this 51? Did I use the BP up to beef up the gun? Not yet. I wanted to see how much a XP I need to level up again. And then I'm going to do it. Yo, these fuckers and their ball attacks. My dumbass. Fuck, I forgot to... <laughs> I forgot to take the other weapons and the tools I have and add more effects to the AM44. Fuck. I got all these slots. I ain't got shit in here. I was going to add, like, tranquilizer. I was going to add whatever else I could add to this. All right, while we're doing this, uh, what are some of the best stats or the best things I can add to these guns? By the way. Like, what are the best uh, effects? That you guys would recommend the fuck is that a squirrel excuse 
Excuse me? Why did he do so much damage to me? Who is it, Daddy? And what does he do? He ran away? I also got confused. That was scary. Damn, they are doing crazy damage up here, dude. I'm a cop, you idiot. This is from the station, yeah. When the dog was going crazy. Squirrel was a bitch, I'll tell you that. <laughs> we should use the BP now. I'm gonna need that shit. He 1000 needled me like Cactuar. When I had first attack on my other weapon, I wasn't, I wasn't, I, I didn't feel like I was attacking first. It was weird. Ah, thank you, Anthony, for keeping track. I appreciate that. I, just, I was just wondering what you're doing. And now we're on 52. These fuckers. Bro, they... Yo, what the fuck? They boxed me in. Thank you for stacking up like idiots, though. I appreciate it. The XP is decent. We're getting about a thousand per three mobs. Somebody said earlier that the yellow shirt looks good on me. Oh my god! Look at this fucking rat! Why does this look so big? Is this is a different different kind of rat? Dre, what's up, man? Everybody, shout outs to Dre. A real good friend of mine. He also got he also has nice cheeks and really good looking calves. Dre, you should make a OnlyFans for your uh, calves. Just saying. Sniped. Oh, double hit you bitch ass. Let's go. He's the gaff master. Can you still dunk, Dre? With calves like these, you can dunk on these nuts. In my dreams. <laughs> Don't sell yourself short, man. I'll give you a boost. God damn, dead end. We're reviving tonight, guys. Good stuff, McFever. Good stuff.
then the music stops when you go in the closet. Now he's coming out the mattress. The motherfucker is under the mattress. <laughs> I love that vine. Damn. Two tools. Three tools. Okay. Well, that'll come in handy when we need to add some more shit to this weapon. By the way, guys, I haven't seen anybody say anything about, like, what are the best uh, effects and add sh what are the best uh, status effects that I should add to this weapon? Because I have, I have eight slots for this gun. That's just stupid. And I didn't put a single thing besides the three that I had on the previous gun on here. Oh, next floor? Hey, what are we at? 53 now? Oh no, McPhee, I, I didn't think you were bragging. It's all good, man. 53, 53, 53. Anthony with the clutch. Kill this motherfucking rat. I'm getting hit by that. Wow, actually, you died? Well, at least we're gonna level up at least once before we get into the next fight. Triple command. What weapon has uh, triple command? Cyanide. Is that what I'm using right now? The acid? Triple commands on floor 61. 70, nice. The M96R, thank you. Kill this motherfucker. You piece of shit. Wow, I killed this bitch ass and I still got hit by that. Bounty ball rats, man. They suck. What about armor? What effects should I put on the armor? That is pretty strong. It's like 20 above. Damn. My dude. Yeah, my next trip back to the uh, thing, I'm putting that back. I'm putting that on. That armor is crazy. Welcome back, Chris. What floor are we on? We're on 53 right now, Leviathan. Still got 24. Oh, these fuckers. And the ATB is like crazy high. These fucking rats. It ain't rats, it ain't never rats. Six years to go. Yes. Gotta go down. 
<laughs> that was a weird. She started like started stuttering. Shite. What are you thinking about this armor now? Hmm. This SP armor though, man. You just take this, throw that on there. There is a super tool. Remove our HP max over. Or is 51? Crazy. 51. The extra 22 on top of what I have. Daughter. Do, 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 do. Super tool, the HP max over. Let's do it. <coughs> Bless me, thank you. Oh, is this floor 54? Nope, oh, it's a fucking dead end. Let's go sooth. Let's go sooth, guys. This is dead end. I knew it. I'm like, wait, the south close up like this? It could only mean I'm either going backwards, which I'm not, or it's a dead end. And this is the next floor. We are on 54 now, guys. this rate we might be done with this at four another two hours or so we'll have we'll have to see depends on how crazy these next bosses are are the next bosses by any chance as crazy as that cockroach because oh my god that was terrifying i dodge your motherfucking bullets bro i can't wait for triple command his run <laughs> this ain't it no way yep that's what i thought it ain't ever that easy but you gotta check Well, now we know. The fanciest of runs. What you got in here, motherfuckers?
one's gonna be an enemy. It's gonna hit me like 400. It's gonna hit me for 400. No, MP5 SD. Interesting. However long it takes, Anthony. However long it takes. However, if we die, we'll definitely have to continue this another time. <laughs> so I'm trying to be extra careful, saving all my uh, healing items, using my PE energy right now. There's a uh, floor 55. Thanks for that, I'm doing my best. <sighs> I just feel like no matter how high your defense is, you're still taking a lot of damage in this game. Like it sucks, but it doesn't. It doesn't feel like you're actually making a big. Di it's not. It doesn't feel like you're actually making a big deal of difference with better armor. I don't know why. I mean, that's okay though. Like it has a hard aspect to it, you know. Fuck you. Reload. I love that run. south marathon run aha this is a dead end <gasps> no way did i walk all the way back how did i get turned around when did i get turned around Ook. yeah their animation is stupid Oh my god, I got hit by both of that. <sighs> Damn, that's so frustrating. I just backtracked so far. I didn't even realize I did that. Was it from here? Because I think I went right and it was like a dead end. At least the music's good. <laughs> Floor 55 is a piece of shit. Across. 
south. Now we gotta go south. Yep, south. I think this is where I made the mistake. This is probably where I made the mistake. I probably went across without realizing it. It's fucking squirrels. And they run away, too. Oh my god, really? Dude, this is annoying. running away that's so weird well at least i got a medicine four out of that oh my god that confusion fucks you up all right now we're getting to the we're getting to some fair some very hard parts of the game did anybody else just get a manscaped ad like an actual ad just showed up That's cool because I'm sponsored by them. Elevator. Okay, this better not be taking me back. Oh my god, did this take me all the way back? What the fuck? Dude, I came here, I went right, and there was a fucking wall here. I couldn't go here before. Bro, this game is trying my life right now. I hate this floor. Did it just give me one XP for killing one? I think so. I wasn't paying attention. I was, I'm in shock right now. I gotta go south here. Bro, this game. Fuck going left. I'm going right. Can I just leave? Please. There we go. We got to make some. Yes, there we go. 50, 56 now. Floor 56, guys. 55 took forever. Backtrack twice. I don't know why that happened. That was so stupid. Uh, Chong, uh, the boss on 56. I mean, sorry, on 60. Is it crazy? Need haste the entire time. Gotcha. Need to host. Host and triple command. Go up, if not up, then south. It's faster than me. Oh, great. Rather lovely. Ronald Weasley, it's the real soul. Wow, it actually fucking came all the way back around. Get on this side. I took a lot of damage that time. Came from the right, almost went back there. 
I'm gonna try to leave one alive so this way I can build some AP. I mean, PE back. Wow, those eyes quickly. Okay. Never mind. We are currently on floor 56, guys. 57 coming up soon. Ass. I need to get into a fight and uh, build back up my PE energy. I'm gonna go right if this way doesn't pan out. Hey, elevator. Usually a good sign. Okay. Usually not a good sign. <laughs> not in that scenario. Why couldn't these have phones in them to save? What is that attribute? Stops fireballs? Shoots fireballs? Oh fuck, what's my health at? This is probably gonna hit me for hard. 272, not too bad. Fake news, I lied. I lied, guys. Fake news. I'm using the medicine twos at this point. Because that'd be too easy to save, right? <laughs> of course. Hungry for words. Hungry for worms. Haha, <laughs> shut up. This is dead end. So we're on, I think we're on 56? Oh no, we're on 57. So the next floor would be 58. Anthony's not here anymore to keep track for us. Can somebody write 58 right now? Or sorry, 57 in the chat. And we're about to get to floor 58. Feel it in my bones. In my lonely bones, right here. This is floor 58. Thank you, Gustavo. Now, Gustavo, right? Floor 58. Or just write 58. Mm -hmm. Let's try going right. Actually, no. Right was one of the paths we had to go to go up. So let's go up. We're at 58 now, guys. I think. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate y'all. Appreciate you guys. Teamwork, making the dream work. All right, we're gonna have to kill one of these guys and build up our PE energy. Gotta separate them first.
That's good enough. M712 has the counterattack attribute, really. M712. Oh, that's what that is. Counterattack. Definitely putting that on there. Actually, maybe we should put it on now. I can put it on right now. I have a tool. I have tools on deck. Should have did it before this fight. That's going to come in handy. Especially against those confusing ass squirrels. What? Okay. Um. What direction did that come from? Let's see. right there I didn't see it proc there. I didn't notice if it proc'd at least. So, up didn't work. Let's go right. I think that's where I... Is that where I came from? I hope it's not where I came from. 77 floors, McFever. Okay. Um, Don't remember if I passed an elevator coming up. Well, we'll know off of this. This will tell us. If this is all brand new. And it is. Four. Okay, so we're going the right way. S12. S burst. E2. We'll recover an enemy. CRM armor. Damn, this one is good. This one's real good. Much better. Damn. Fuck. Uh, that's alright. Still got lots of tools. Switch over. Let's save it. We're gonna wait on... We're gonna wait on switching to that one. We're on 58. So, 59 is almost there. Then we get to fight the next boss at 60. So I went south on this one. We gotta go back north if it fucks up. And of course, it fucked up. Thank you everybody for hanging out with me, by the way, as we run through this godforsaken endgame. The 32 of you guys that have been sticking with us from, from the beginning of the stream, some of you guys joined in the middle. Appreciate all of you guys. Thank you. Five nine guys. Five nine guys. Five nine. Thank you, Nathan. 
Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Thank you, War Angel. I would hate it if I just went through so many transitions right there. And it's like, this is a dead end. It's like, why? Why do you do this to me? Enemy, yeah. Was it 278 damage? 400, oh my god. Will he die quickly? All right, pretty quickly. Oh God, that was terrifying. My God. Yo, that would have killed me if I didn't heal before I opened this one. That was at 424 health. Wow, double hits. At least he dies in four shots. I'm gonna say it. I'll take that other revive. I mean, that's gonna come in clutch. My god, that would have sucked. That was a trap and a half. Yeah, the counterattack isn't proccing right now, which is weird. I haven't, at least I haven't noticed it proccing. The dead end. Yep. Sometimes you can tell it's like, hey, this is way too, we just got to this floor. There's no way we already found the stairs. Of course not. You got to go through so much other shit. Plus, we didn't even pass the elevator yet. south <laughs> nope this is a dead end too what would really trigger me is if we go right and it's a dead end also like this game and square stuff all right there's the elevator but this could be a dead end we're not Well, either way, I'm just very happy that my uh, water consumption has been very good tonight. Yeah, they definitely shove those enemies in the chest to kill you if you're not paying attention. And then sometimes they give you a revive right there. But to do half my health right there, imagine if I didn't heal after that first one. I would have been so pissed. Well, actually, we would have used the revive. We have two, I think. Oh, it's fucking rats, dude. The one thing I did like about uh, the double shots was that since I shot them four times, but while I'm shooting them, they're in hit stun and I'm building back up ATB to attack again. That's one thing I did like about it. Kind of sucks that I don't have it now, but still the damage trade-off is okay. Oh, that's going to hit me, isn't it? Nope, it's not. Okay. What the fuck, dude? Natalie, what's up? I'm late to the party. This, sorry if this question has been asked, but what platform is this being played on? EPSXC. Thank you, Nathan. Appreciate that. What's up, Natalie? Welcome to the channel. 
Oh, is this the next floor? Holy shit. So this should be 60, meaning the boss should be here. And I'm at half eight. I'm at half PE. Fuck. I'm kind of nervous right now. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, fuck. Now I'm at 60. So... You have to still walk up. You still have to get through floor 60. In order to get through it, it looks like. So 61 is where we fight that next boss. Oh, it's fucking rats. Rats? It ain't never rats. What? Where the hell did it go? I ain't asking no questions. I'm taking that. Taking that shit to the grave, fool. Reload, reload, reload. Yes, medicine four. Looking for that. Dun 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 Wonder if I level up. Oh, he's gonna die. Nope, oh, still alive. And he's gone. The monster ran away. We still got a long way to go to level up. My god, what was I talking about? Next floor is probably gonna give like 3k XP. This is a dead end. Yeah, next floor should give a, around the same experience points. Not next floor, sorry. Uh, the next, like from floor 61 and up, will probably be giving us more XP like the museum was. But much harder enemies, of course. Like, this shit is doable, but man, it's tough. It's tough, especially when you get to this floor. My god. That roach, man. That roach got me, man. I wonder I've been afraid of roaches all my life. Stan, Ginoza, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Appreciate it, man. If you're here on a live stream, say what's up. Let's chat for a little bit, man. Elevator, that's a good sign, usually. Say like 75% of the time you see the elevator, that usually means you're getting closer. Other times it means they are assholes and they put it on a dead f uh, dead end. See ya. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm gonna go... Go left. I feel like we've been coming from the right. So, left. Oh my god, another plus? Alright, let's check up. You never know, it could just be up here. Ah, this is gonna lead to a... Should lead to a dead end, I think. I doubt it, man. This fucking building's layout makes no sense. Hate it. Some of the enemies are hard to figure out where they were. Yeesh. Okay. Well, let's look at it. Okay, real quick. We got one, two, three, four, five, six re revives. We got a decent amount of health. I mean, healing items. So we're going to start off with haste. We're going to keep haste up, just like Chong said. 
see what's going on in this fight. Oh, it's the crab. Fucking crab battle. The lasers. Shit. Can I dodge if I go right? Can I go right in between? Oh, I still got hit by both. Piece of shit. How dare you? Uh... Left hand, I'm guessing. Damn, I'm out of shot. At least I hit all three targets at the same time. So maybe I should just hit the middle then. I thought it hit me for 55. That shit, the number was off the screen just now. Dude, what the fuck? Yo, that attack is, attack is fucked up. A weapon to surprise Metal Gear. Hell yeah, dude. Oh my God. The damage was like off screen, so I couldn't see how much I was getting hit for, but my God, that was like ridiculous to avoid. All right, bitch ass. Pussy ass. Ouch. Whatever. I'm gonna use another, uh, I'm gonna use another Medicine 3. Double lasers, man, no joke. Reload, reload. Sucks. Oh, I actually dodged it. I actually dodged it. Oh my god. Fuck this crab, bro. This is a weapon truly to surpass Metal Gear. There, where is the lie? Oh, I forgot. Does enemy slow work? Oh my god, dude. Fucking crap, bro. Right, right now, your boy is very terrified. Son of a bitch, bro. Oh, I'm dead. This is my last revive, I think. Oh god, I'm scared. No, did he double up? <sighs> oh, fuck this crab, bro. Come on! Oh, that was my... Okay, I ha this, is, this is my last revive. Yo, how do you dodge this shit? Bro, would uh, what was that move? The one that slow would slow work at all on him? Yo, this bubble beam is disgusting, dude. Fuck, I have to use this. Come on, I uh, I'm dead. Let's have another full revive. Oh, I have a lot of revives left. Okay, I'm still good. I'm just gonna haste. Bro. This dude is hitting me for like crazy ass damage. It's not even fair. <laughs> dude, what the fuck? How do you dodge this shit?
Bro, that took everything. And it didn't even... It didn't even level me up, man. Yo, that fucking crap. How much... How many revives do I have? I got one, two, three, four... How do I still have so many revives left? Did I miscount? I had way more than I thought I did. Oh my god. One, two, three, four... Four revives. Never stay in front of boss. Thank you, Chong, so much. I really appreciate that. Better late than never. Wow, then. So let's... Let's just go back. This is weird. It's like it didn't show we went up a floor. You see that? It was on the same same side. Okay, I gotta go right, I think. Down right to go to the elevator. Unavoidable 500 damage attack. There we go. Thank you, Omen. That shit was oh, I was clenching, man. Clenching pretty hard, not gonna lie. Today is not that day indeed. I need to go farm some uh, med fours or some shit. <laughs> Jesus. Yeah, farm med threes and get some levels while I'm at it, right? Oh wait, there's the elevator. What am I doing? I just walked right by it. <laughs> Fucking crab. <laughs> Fuck out of here, crab. Oh my god. Yo, extra bitch ass. About to order some seafood. After I aggressively urinate. In a sec. My god, I was terrified that fight. I was like, I don't want to climb these 10 floors again. Please, please don't make me do this again. And thank God I had more revives than I thought. Jesus. That fight was ass. Trying to see if I could take some guns back. This dude. So what I got. What, uh, so what should I pull off of weapons to put onto this? I'm just going to take all these here. I don't know what's on what or what has what. I'm going to transfer a bunch of these over and we're just going to see, take which ever attributes are very useful. Cheeks were almost clapped there indeed, McFever. All right, Omen, have a great night, man. Or a great day. Thank you. Take all stats. Everything. Yeah, we're gonna take a look. I don't remember which has what has what. We're gonna look at everything. Fuck, I should I guess I should do the armor too. That I think of. 
I don't know. Yeah, those quick fires, I'm looking for all that shit. Of weapons, a lot of weapons. Quick draw, first attack, right? That's it. Might as well. Is Tranquilizer worth it? I feel like it would be. Incendiary. That might not come in clutch because certain enemies aren't weak against Incendiary, right? Yeah, I don't I don't know. I don't know, no Gandus. Let me see. I think this is Tranquilizer, right? Oh, this is Frost Effect. So, which one is Trank? This one? Oh, Frost as well. I forget which one's a Trank. What color is it? Green? Maybe I don't have it. Yeah, never take fire and ice. Many enemies resist both. That's what I, that's what I remember. However, I don't remember... This one... This one has Trank. Not that one, of course. I already clicked it. Stupid. Wait for the Senide. Gotcha. Other than that, I don't think there is anything else I could put on here. Both acid. What about armor? ATP is going down. I don't have a super tool to remove it though. Fuck. Wonder if I should use this now. Or I'll, I'll wait till I get a super tool. So give me some time from now. Yeah, let me get some more weapons. I want to see what other, what stats do these ones have? We 
we're just gonna take a little looky. You have Wayne the T cards? Gotcha. Alright, let me look let me look at this first and then I'll uh, put stuff back in there so I can make space to take out the T cards. Uh just look at what these have to offer. That's rapid fire. Frost again. None of these ain't got good shit. Okay, putting the shit back. Nathan Garay, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing and scaring the shit out of me. Oh my god. <laughs> if you're on the live stream, say what's up, my dude. Got me shook for a sec. Let me know. Did you guys jump in the chat too? I actually got scared by that. Love it. Hurt me, Snake. A lot. How much longer am I going to stream for? I'm going to try to get to the ending, dude. Right to like 5 a.m., so another two hours. I keep extending it two hours. Make sure that's all the cards. Believe in the heart of the cards. Mamma mia. I give it to him like i mean wasting a slot here all right josh have a great night man thanks for hanging out as long as you did my dude if you, i didn't even realize you were still here you're probably still on genshin right have a good night man ain't nothing to it i'm gonna put on that other i get that other armor so i can add slots to it Ain't nothing to it. Wait, whoops, I could have talked to him right there and did it. I don't remember which one it is. I'm just gonna grab these CR crazy looking ones. That's it. Oops. It is that one. I hate this walking animation he has to do, man.
He looks like it weighs like 60 pounds. Yeah, he's like holding it like, uh, uh, link, yo, yo. <laughs> it ain't like that. Keep giving it to him? Alright, I gotta grab another armor to give slots to now. I wish you could just give them the cards and then you can come back and get the the extra slot but it sucks that you actually have to have something to apply it to or else he doesn't take the card I think this might be the last one. I gotta double check. The rare cards? Aren't these the rare ones? The ones with the names on them, right? Oh, let me look back because these are all the ones that I have that have names on it. Yeah, see, you gotta have a permit or a T card. You want to tune up, so I use them all. That's it. I guess there's more to bring them, right? Yo, what's up, Bart? How you doing? Yeah, I gave him everything that I had. That was all that I had left. He dropped these back off to him. All right, no worries. Be in a little bit. McFever. Let's go save. Let's see if we can farm some medicine threes because Jesus Christ. Shit is rough. The thing that sucks though is that I already fought the T-Rex, so the encounter rate's gonna be fucking ass at the museum. the SVU office in here. Do, 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 do.
Oh, yeah. Museum. You get some good stuff from the rare T card quest. The rest of the rare cards are going to be in the Chrysler Tower. Damn, man. It's fucking floors. It sucks. Use the bathroom. I'll be right back, guys. I'll be back. I'll go anywhere. Hit that like button if you haven't yet. We're almost at 100 likes. Oh, you get tons of med fours on floor 61 to 70? Fight. We're just getting into two fights here. Yeah, I still want to get that triple command. Well, I get floor 61 to 70, I get triple command, right? I got tools on me just in case. Alright, War Angel, have a good night, man. Thank you for hanging with us for as long as you did. Yeah, I'm gonna go back. If you get a lot of med, med fours on 61 to 70, I mean, they should do that. Did I already answer this? Nope. Got a tool, though. Seven rare T cards, so I might be off by one. Yeah, still no fights. Yeah, this place sucks after you kill the fucking T Rex. Still no fighty fight. It was like more XP than I got in one f 20 floors. No fighty fights here? No fights. What's up, Sid? Uh, no, there's 70 floors, 77 floors, actually. And we are on floor 61. 
I'm gonna head back over there now. I'm trying to get into some fights here, but the respawn rate here is I mean, it's not that great. Not doing great. Oh, you mean energy shot? Wouldn't liberate be better than energy shot? Does they both use them all here? Huh, PE. At 61 now, and Cactuar Squirrels. Those fuckers. Yeah, the respawn rate drops dramatically. There's about 17 floors left. So I'm gonna try to do these last 10. And you know what I'm thinking? I, I wanna I wanna finish this on stream, but it depends, obviously, how long it'll take. Um with those bosses being as hard as they are, I can't imagine what the final boss is actually going to feel like. My cheeks are going to get destroyed. I can only imagine. So I'm thinking maybe off stream, I could work myself up to the 77th floor. Or, I don't know, save. And once I get up there, come back down, and then just we finish it up there on Friday. And start Parasite Eve 2. Same time. Tracy, what's up? We we got our cheeks clapped by that bubble ray, but we we pretty much uh, destroyed it. I didn't know that you had to stay on its side the whole time. That was rather annoying. Please, I hope that I'm going the right way. Can't remember place sucks i know when you come up to the plus the double plus you go left twice and up might be it right here Fuck, man. Went all the way the wrong way. I fucking hate this shit so much. Square, you're a bunch of bitches for doing this fucking endgame like this in 1998. My god. It's so stupid. Yeah, it's because we already cleared these floors, Gustavo. <sighs> Just trying to get back up. The music starts back up once we get up. It's just a royal pain in the ass. Oh my god. My demeanor. My demeanor has shifted from when the game, when we started playing. <laughs> I am salty. Welcome to the salty spittoon. How salty are you? I'm fucking salty, man. This is a dead end. Yeah, killing the boss on this level gets rid of the encounters for this entire spot. That's why the music isn't playing either. I think I came from the right. Oh, 
Wait, elevator is here. Let her go left? Go left, let me see. Oh, yeah, here we go. Renal, thank you so much for subscribing. Welcome to the channel. If you are here, say what's up in the chat. Guys, we need five more likes to get to 100 likes on this live stream. If you haven't yet, hit that like button, please. And I think this is it. Yeah, this is it. Right here. God, it took like 10 minutes to get to the fucking beginning of where we need to get to the final, like, flights of steps. Now, can somebody confirm? Is it 77 or is it 70? Whoa. New song. Sounds like Final Fantasy VIII. Oh shit. Wow. Shoot his ass. Yes. Decent XP. Two bosses left at 70 and 77. Oh my god. God. I was not trying to get hit by that dude. Yo, I got fucking gang raped right there. That was ridiculous. Y'all just like cornered on me, man. My God. Take it a break. Also, I haven't gotten any heals yet. I'm here. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Oh my god. Fucking heart attacks here, dude. Oh man. Don't know storage rooms.
What's up, Juju Blitz? Come to Vegas? To Vegas? Sure, baby. I had plans to come to Vegas this year. If it wasn't for, uh, you know what I mean? COVID. I was coming for Evo. All right, so this should be floor 71. Sorry, 61. Bro, the enemies on this one are real. Shit, these fuckers. I don't even want to imagine what the hell my cheeks are about to go through. Reload. I died. Wow. Wow. Dude, fuck. What to focus on first there? That was just... That was just bullshit. Fuck. Did I get the item room last floor? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. Fuck. Yeah. One, two, three, three revives. All right, fuck, I'm gonna go back. Gotta backtrack and check that, look for the storage fucking closet. What's up, Souls, how you doing? It's going all right, man, but these, uh, these last couple floors are fucked up. <laughs> Let's find this stupid ass storage room, my God. Why has it got to be missable? Gotta actually go searching for this shit. So to the right, let's go north. Right path there, that's the go back. Enemies! These fuckers. Gotta wait for them to attack. Oh! Shit, sneaks! Ah! Oh. I couldn't go around them, I thought I could. my life man this is so dumb hey look we got some medicine fours finally Jesus rough one man all right i went i came from there to the left so when i come back here i gotta go south I'm feeling like up here i should come across or should be able to come across the storage closet unless i already came from here i don't know fuck i wish you could drop flags tell That unavoidable attack is just fucking stupid. I killed him just in time. Action pack move. It has been a while, dude. I'm happy to have you back. I hope all is well. We are having a great time right now getting our cheeks clapped by these fucking enemies.
Yeah, the squirrels have been getting in the way though. It's been great. I feel like I'm backtracking, but I'm trying to see if I can find the storage room, which isn't here. The left would be where I came from, so I think I have to go south again. Go back and take the opposite path from where I was going from. Try that out. They're going left. South is to continue. Oh god, a fucking bear. Okay, that was crazy. Yeah, I can't imagine doing this shit without uh, burst. Definitely need burst for this part. Oh my god. Alright, elevator. Storage room can't be too far from here. Oh. Check up. Okay, doesn't feel right. Feel like I'm going too far. What? Very square to have a side dungeon multiple times harder than the end game. <laughs> yes. This shit is no joke, man. Each fight I've died at least once in. Yo, fucking hit him, man. I ain't risking him. Heal him twice. This is a circling path. I figured that it's much. Back at the top. South is to continue, so back left. And then south when we get to the vertical. Yeah, the elevator. What fucking direction do I go? Unless I go back to the path where I'm supposed to continue and go north? I don't know. Path on the left to the exit of this floor. Let's see. FF16 is going to be amazing. Can't wait. Me too, dude. 
Oh, action pack. Thank you, man. This is just this part is just this part gets to you, man. Mentally, this part really tries you. Just can't believe how much uh, you get hit in this part. It's like it's fucked up. Some real messed up shit goes down in this area. Well, let me check my fantasy app real quick. Right is the exit, I think. So let's go left. Oh my God, it was here. There'll be an enemy in here that one shots me just for fun. First one's going to be a monster, dude. Gonna give me a break on this shit. And why is it first draw procking? Uh, as I say that, it procs. Game. Game's trying. Trying my patience. Uh, I can still die from that. But I have to use the medicine for. Because if this is an enemy, it'll kill me. And it's a type 3 E card. GST, what's up, man? Ouch. Let's just see what is left. I feel like this is a circling path. Or a dead end. Yep, dead end. Well, that was the first floor. <laughs> of the next nine? Oh my god, man. I don't know, this is tough. I need to get into a fight with an enemy that I can continuously dodge to build back up my PE energy because it's pretty low and I don't know. I'm not trying to use uh, more med, med fours. I need to save those. I only have two. I got three revives. Hey, no worries, GSC. Hope all is well with you, man. Do 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 do. Better prepare since the boss at the 70th floor has several unavoidable attacks. Yeah, about preparing. I mean, the only way I can prepare is by farming items. And by farming items, I'm getting my cheeks clapped and unfortunately using those items. So. Is it an unwritten rule that by the storage clo the the exit, the storage closet is usually nearby? It sucks, dude. to die. This is the part where you fall down. There's a five hundred dollar sunglasses, asshole. Yeah, this part this part sucks, man. I need to level up, man. Just, uh, we're kind of, eh, it's almost there. It's like four more fights, I think. Maybe five, five more fights. I level up. Hopefully we get a lot of BP from it. Dead end.
Really? 40th floor and above are vast. 60th floor and above are randomly generated. That's amazing. The ultimate dungeon. Hey, throw a closet. Stop putting enemies in here, please. First thing they do. All right, it's this motherfucker. Dude ain't that bad to deal with. I'm just gonna shoot him twice. Fuck, I wasn't... Crit's gonna kill him. I was just gonna, like, hold up and just let him build up my... My PE. Got a pimple on my shoulder. Oh, what is that? Purple. SV armor. Or inventory. And offense. Well, I'm curious. I just want to see what this is. Cyanide to bullets. I was told many times I need to put this on. So, doing it. Hey Blitz, is there a reason you don't utilize save states, especially in situations like this? I mean, we'll definitely have to use a save state coming up, Mike. Completely forgot about them. Uh, for certain games, when I was younger, a save state really fucked me up where I used the save state in a point where I couldn't return and it really messed me up and... I don't know, it was just, it was just, ner it, was just it just really f fucking pissed me off. So let me see... I can use a save state here. Save state, slot one. We'll definitely save state before we fight that next boss. Wow. That was the fastest floor. Oh my god. I thought I was like, what? A dead end? So where the fuck am I going to go? And... I actually went through 62 or 62 or 63 i don't know don't know these fuckers i'm gonna have to wait for them to launch their attack just coming in now oh and the sneaks i'll target the this one Yeah, good shit, Mike. I forgot about save states, but if I remember correctly, it might have been Pokemon. I use a save state and I bypass this like save point that I need to double back to and I couldn't because I use a save state so far in and I was so mad at myself. Eagle card? EE card. Up five, oh my God. Damn. Is that the ultimate? Is this the ultimate armor in the game? Bro, this is crazy. Hold up. Is this the best armor in the game? Wow. Wow. That's a lot, dude. Damn. Ultimate armor. Use it. Most definitely. Let's... 
this on. No more super tools, so walk it. Boom. Jeez. That's a lot of, that's a lot of defense. We need that defense. Pokemon is bad. I was trying to do Nuzlocke and mess up the save. I couldn't regular save and Pokemon White forces you to regular save a few times. I haven't played Pokemon since. Sounds tragic. Leviathan, thank you so much, man. You have a great night. What just happened there? Did I just do 900 damage? What was that? Is it... All I did was change armor, but if anything, that lowered my damage because it took away the plus two that I got off of offense. Why did that? Is it, was it cyanide? Definitely a crit, for sure, but Cyanide insta kills most enemies. Gotcha. South or north? I don't know. Try south first. Cyanide, Jesus. Can I read what the cyanide does again? It doesn't say, it just says cyanide, right? This <laughs> is uh, floor 64, I think. I want to get that triple command. Storage closet early. I like it. We'll recover. And then 500. That's like the third, fourth time you can come across that shotgun. <laughs> About to level up. Hopefully that level gives me a, def a decent enough of a boost. Dead end, of course. And some Ernemies. Please crit them again. Damn, that just... 828 damage, is that what that said? Oh my god. I just murdered him. I am evil.
Oh, well. Came from there. It's definitely interesting that they use cyanide. Cyanide and happiness. And now it's definitely half. The new armor is crazy. All right, I gotta pay attention to the damage here. 900 on that one. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo. That was crazy. Big difference. Big fucking difference here. Now I can feel I feel comfortable now. My cheeks are I'm not I'm not keistering anymore. <laughs> Legit, I was puckering up the whole time. I'm like, oh, please don't do it, don't do it to me. But it worked out. Good shit on the cyanide. My god. It's a game changer. Hopefully it does that much damage on the boss. These fuckers. Six, 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 six. About to level up. Yes. Oh my god. I'm going to do even more damage now. I wonder how much BP I earned from this level. Being over 30... Five. Don't recall us hitting over 35. Actually, wait, yeah, from the bosses in the actual end game. All right, this should be 65. Should, uh, use a save state. Piece of shit. Thing. Let's see. How much is it? That's a lot of BP. My God. Zay, what's up, man? How's the Chrysler building going? It's clapping our cheeks, but we're trying to clap it back now. Is 879 the max HP? It leveled up and it didn't go up. Interesting. All right. So what should I use my bonus points on now, guys? What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. You guys know best. What are the, uh, what should I use my BP on? 9,000. Kirish, what should I use it on? Should I use it on uh, all damage? ATB? I mean, that, like, more damage, right? What do you think? Let's try to do it from now. We'll go up to 65. Or actually, we'll go to 70. 70 BP. 70 ATB.
set defense up. Fuck it. Yo, crazy. Also crit because you lost some. Ooh, too late. Too late, souls. Gotta use that safe state and go back. Where the fuck did y'all come from? Oh my god, that damage. Let's go. Came from left, I think. Three likes to a hundred likes, guys. Thank you so much. That's cyanide, though. What's up, Juju? Defense. Fuck with me. Let's go. Pretty close to the top. Yes. Damn that bastard. So much damage and you're not going to give me a... Anything really to use? 134k to level up now. Yep. That's a lot. F1 to use a save slot, I think, but to try it out let's try it out now f1 i guess that means it worked how close am i i'm on floor 65 now i think so 12 more floors i think kirish did uh level 99 juju Vigorous grinding. Sneaks and bear. Bear and sneaks. But the 1000 though. Fuck you, bear. Go extra crusty ass. F tree to load. I think when I'm loading, I'm just going to take my time and uh, hit the load button. Get my crotch fan back. Crotch fan, yes. Ah, uh, really? No way, Kirish. It's crazy. After 96, you jump automatically to 99. Wow. That's crazy. So from 38 to 99 is 4,500 each. It's crazy. What am I at now? 36? Oh, next floor. Nice. 80. We're on 66 now. Give me a fight. Fight me now.
Gas Queen Slay. Fucking cyanide is no joke, man. Oh my god. Me too, Zay. It's my very first time doing the Chrysler building. It's a chore, I can't lie. Doc. How much you gonna hit me for? Four hundred? Four hundred? Really? Two in one room? Bunch of assholes. ATB plus handgun and haste almost guaranteed infinite ATB as your ATB charge before even the next ATB. <laughs> Parasite Eve remake will include 140 floors and she's gonna run slower. <laughs> This is, I feel like, leading to a dead end, but I'll have to see. I already got the um, storage closet. Damn, my arm. Did I stop playing Ghost of Tsushima completely? Uh, actually, I haven't touched it since the last stream where we kept crashing, but I figured out the crash and figured out why that kept happening, and we have a fix to have it stop happening. So, I definitely want to play more Ghost of Tsushima. It's just so hard with all the um, the games and all the new stuff we have coming out. It's like a little difficult. Because in order to keep my channel's um, flow of income coming in, I have to do a Final Fantasy related video because that's the algorithm that agrees with my channel. Anytime I do any any type of other video, it doesn't really do so well. It's weird, but. Get your ass, bitch. Yeah, I, um, I have to do at least one Final Fantasy video, or at least two vi Final Fantasy related videos a week, so this way I get some like steady pulls into the the channel. You know, just just because it's my full time job, and the streams and stuff can be whatever. It doesn't really matter. But on top of like you know making those videos and like trying to figure out like what game to stream next and doing these old school ones, it does take a little bit of a toll on me i do want to do like I, I really want to finish ghost of tsushima and then we have to return back to ghost of tsushima because co-op is coming out so there's a lot of stuff i still want to cover with the game dodge your bitch ass No, it's not that I lost interest in Ghost of Tsushima. It's just that one bullet donated like $300 for us to play LOD. And I'm like, all right, let's play LOD. <laughs> and then after LOD, I just, I got into the grind of wanting to play like these old school games. And it's just been, we've just been attracting a wider audience, you know? And Ghost of Tsushima, I love it. I really do. But sometimes it just, you know, mentally it just, I'm not there. Hey, no worries, Chris. You have a great night, man. Thank you so much. Chilling with us for so long, and hopefully work is great for you tomorrow, man. Floor 67. Does the cyanide uh, damage effect take effect on the boss, too, or no? Yeah, most definitely, GST. Most definitely. And they weren't wrong at all. Like, you know, on top of, like, one bullet, I mean, you know, I had people like Isaac and Mojo and Josh already telling me that, hey, you need to play Ghost. I mean, you need to play LOD. And sure enough, dude, they weren't wrong at all, man. I, I, I really, I really thoroughly enjoyed that game. And I'm super thankful to have played it on stream with you all. 
The Suikoden games, I watched my cousin play them when I was younger. I think it was Suikoden 2. But I actually personally never played them myself. But that's on the list. Like, people have recommended me to play that game. So we went, we came from the right, went up. So if this doesn't pan out, I gotta go back down. Oh, storage closet. Cyanide, useless on boss, of course, in square, soft, or typical Square Enix fashion. But does it still do like lots of, do we, are we still gonna be doing this much damage to bosses? Go crusty ass out of here, boy. That damage? Weapon damage up? Oh, that's a crit up. Gotcha. Crit percentage. Ooh, that's going to be crazy. Let's save in here. If you wake if you wake up and I'm still streaming, hey, it just might be the case. Fuck, did I come from left or right? I don't remember. Did I come from this way, guys? Let me know while I'm fighting this. Trials of Sky. Trials in the sky and cold steel. Yeah, somebody did recommend me that. Uh, yeah, we already came from here, so let me continue going up. Just, just to make sure, because I mean, we storage closet was there. Oh, look, in double fights. Ah, oh, come on! I didn't want to get hit by that. Have a nice night, Chris. Yo, one like to get to 100 likes, guys. If you haven't yet, hit that like button, please. We're almost at 100. Wait a second. Nope. That ends. I feel like it was good to, good, too good to be true. Hey, 100 likes, guys. Thank you so much. Appreciate that, man. Trials in the Sky is the older one made, and it takes place before Steel. And it's on PlayStation? Or is, is it on PC? I can get it on PC. Yo, Neji, thanks for chilling with us still. Been on here for a while, my dude. It's on the stem. Now, is it online based in any way, or is it uh, offline? Is it completely offline? Dead end. A hey, hundred and one likes, man. Thank you guys so much. It's offline. Gotcha. All right, I'll look into uh, getting it a super secret special way. I feel so much better with the cyanide and armor. Oh my god. I was so nervous when we first started like this these sequence of floors. I'm like, oh my fucking god, how am I gonna make it through this? 
I mean, look at this shit. Bro. Fucking disgusting. I love it. And this should be the next floor. Yes. Okay. I was about to say, none of that... None of that made sense. Gonna save again. Look at that shit indeed. Yeah, the cyanide we got in uh, Chrysler. It was actually like two, three floors ago. It wasn't too long ago, Zay. I think after I got it, you had uh, just joined the stream. Complete difference. With thanks to Quick Draw too. And we're getting hit by that. worth it indeed it's insane I'm wondering that as well, Zay. I'm pretty sure it will be. The cyanide not going to have effect on the boss. In typical Square, Soft, Square Enix fashion. Status effects don't really affect bosses like that, but... Uh, it's going to be interesting to see. Save point again. Let's say, let's go south. 70th and the 77th... To the 77th floor are very challenging. Oh, those are the bosses you mean. Because you fight the boss on the 70th, and then you fight the other the final boss on the 77th, right? There's no way. Yeah, I'm like, this, that was just way too easy. Unavoidable attacks. It's so annoying. Why would they? Why would they include some shit like that? Unavoidable attacks. Are these the same ones that lower your defense too? Oh wow, all the way here for nothing. No fights either, crazy. Oh, it's 406, let me see if the uh, waiver is cleared. around 450 did I go up already I can't I don't remember I don't think I did go up hopefully I got enough revives on deck yeah I did go up this is the dead end um let me see I got one two three four five Six, seven, eight, nine. Got about nine revives. Let's start dropping some tools. Get them revives going. Fuck, I think I came from here. Damn it. 
I keep fucking losing my mind on this. I forgot about pre-raise. Does pre-raise take up all your PE? Like, okay, not as not all of it, but still a lot. I think I came from here. Fuck. I'm gonna go all the way down and make a left. Uh, Liberate is the last ability, I think. Because I don't think you get anything else. Oh, wow. That actually wasn't that bad. That floor wasn't that bad. Enemies, enemies, enemies. get dispelled <laughs> that would suck it gets dispelled it's like damn man eh? boss using mechanics on us dodge yo shit Yeah, the XP is coming on now. It still was better in the museum, but it's much better than it was before. It's gonna be a dead end, yeah. So check up and then down. Already 30k down, man. You're right. All right, down it is. <laughs> you want to fuck? <laughs> Bitch, I will. Eat your booty hole. Elevator, elevator. Storage. Give me shit. So, Kirish, so what should I do? Should I start off the fight with a pre raise? Oh, a super tool? Fucking go.
lowers your PE and damage. Wait, what? PE light, PE burden decreases. Decrease attack power. Attack power. Ah, oh, this shit sucks. Got my face with this shit. Yeah, the PE light is good. Well, yeah, I could take that. Let me do that. Let me do that, actually. For now. Wasn't thinking properly. That foot fetish uh, story was something, right? <laughs> well, a a a a a. In my pe, bitch. crazy to, like, to think you gotta replay this game three times if you want to like get all the good shit and then replay the main story t with all the good shit <laughs> it's like <laughs> like whole oh. oh next stairs yo we're cutting that shit I think this is 68. I lost count. Might be 69. 80? 88 maybe? Saving just in case. You never know. You walk forward and come across another boss fight. Cheeks are not ready to get clapped. Start getting clapped. Beam it for your parents. You run up in the room. They're like, what the fuck is going on? My cheeks got clapped. Oh. 68. Pre-raise and haste on the first turn and then go all out next. Oh. Bitch ass. Pooty tang ass. Nice. I barely used any. Any PE. Pinesy, welcome to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. Love to have you here. Oh my god. I'm so confused on this whole section here. I feel like I'm getting lucky and continuing the areas that I'm heading to. <laughs> like, I feel like I'm just getting... I'm getting super lucky right here. That it just keeps on moving. Unless this, this is a dead end. It has to be a dead end. Oh, it's not. The Prazzled. Another. Oh. Iron Breer. Do the fucking sneaks. What? Yo, we got so much metagens. Yeah.
<sighs> I feel like I've already been here, so I gotta go this way. Gotta be a dead end. Gotta be a dead end, guys. Oh, it's not! Let's go up. I already went down twice. You going top left. Oh! Nope, of course. It's like my ass game. Jesus. With no ranch. You get no ranch. You gotta taste all the minerals. Bitch ass. Dead end too. Yep. You can tell from the camera view, but it also depends on how early into the stage you are in. Because that camera view is also to show that either going backwards or you're going, you're going downstairs or upstairs. But if you're seeing that very early, that means it's most likely a dead end. Uh, let's go down. Yeah, there's still storage on this floor. I think I might find the storage if I go south here. No ranch for you! Why couldn't this game have a UAV? I just went around and I'm at the bottom right Jack Baker welcome to the channel thank you for subscribing got the Vincent notification to pop nice still the final storage Kirish, thank you so much, man. Appreciate it. You have a great rest of your day. It's fucking dead ends. Hopefully, you don't walk into any dead ends. Wherever you are. We are, uh... It's going through it right now, man. Hmm. Oh my gosh. Renee, we are still live. Trying to at least get to this uh, floor 70 boss, and then maybe Friday we can return back and do 77. Because I'd rather do, I'd rather finish and get, you know, finish the final one with everybody, or at least a decent amount of people here present. Oh, MTV Cribs. I like to sprinkle diamonds on my food so my doo doo comes out sparkly. I bought a dinosaur egg because it why because it's the most ballin' as shit ever ballin' as fuck Jakowski I don't know what even makes the encounters worse once you get past level 38, every level is like 4,500 XP compared to 100,000 where it's at right now at level 37, 36. It's kind of funny. This floor right here is a little confusing. 
Dead end. I know, Souls. I just don't know what the fuck to do, though, man. All, all this shit looks stupid. And the game doesn't really give you a good idea of where you gotta go. And this is a dead end, too. Should have went right at the T section. Yeah, that's my favorite MTV Cribs episode with Redman. In New Jersey. Oh, south. All right. Let us go. Elevator. And here. Where should we go? Where to, my friend? Where to? Yeah, I used to watch MTV Cribs a lot, too. Right. Might be that might be that uh dead end I went to already, yep. I did that shit already. Three of these motherfuckers? Yo, I'ma fuck you up. All the bears. Got enough tools to spare. I stock up on that medicine. Let me see where this uh, goes right here. Nowhere. Dude. All right, and left went nowhere. Only way to go is up. Poor fucking sucks, man. So this whole fucking section here is nothing. 
go left at the next T, which is this one coming up here. Bit of left. My god. No, like, there's just no, like, si <laughs> sign of just breaking through and doing it. Level is indeed huge. Yeah, there's two more, uh, there's two more floors I think after this. Jeez. Is it met two in the bottom of my inventory? Oh, there was. from south I think keep going right dead end no nope. no dead end okay let me see this Yes, fuck you too. I love coming to America. Whenever I go to uh, whenever I go to New York to visit my family, we always go check out the the McDowell's location that they had. Yeah, it's one of my favorites. And it's not far from where my cousin lives too. Like a good 15 minutes, 10 minutes. Ah, oh, dead end. I don't, I don't understand. Can't go north. That just fucking brought me around. Uh, let's see. South, I guess. I don't know. All the way south, I guess. I'm
all the way south this is the corner again eventually yeah this is a dead end or not or not wait a sec Pick up that junk. Collect all them junk. Yeah. So we're at this bottom left corner. Right here. Fever, what's up, dude? Okay. I'm at the bottom. I'm at the bottom left. Hard to tell, man. I'd be even happier if they just kept throwing us fights too, just so I can keep leveling up. Gotta find a way to go to top right. Let's do it! No oh, fucking... God, this floor is the worst, dude. <laughs> Bitch. Ah, you dead, scunt. More fights, okay. Ask and ye shall receive. Few more enemies. You go on top right. Or hold on a sec. Wait, wait, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. 
Pretty sure this is a dead end. Yeah, okay. Not surprised. Uh, let's go right. Keep going right. Let's see something. Them a bleach. I'm gonna bleach out their fucking skin. Oh man, this has to be the trickiest floor. There's just... Oh my god. Just no fucking way. This this floor is... We've been on this floor for probably 30 minutes now. And I don't know why. It's just... It's mind-blowing. Why is this like this? Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Oh my god, that was scary. Holy shit. Safe state it is. You have to have haste on. There's no way. And these fucking things keep healing him. I gotta run to the left. Wow. That's some fuckery. Let me see if I can get out of here quick enough. Bitch.
Run, 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 run. What the fuck was that curve, man? Oh my god. I'm gonna have to use two of these. Love this song, but god damn, I feel some angstity right now. Can I make it? Can I make it? Yes! Oh! Alright, we're in good shape right now. Oh God! <laughs> to say that I got I got shook. I'm doing it. Fuck this guy. Fuck this guy. Let's do it. Eat his cheeks. Beat his cheeks. Damn, only two oh three. That's still a lot. Omni Slash is full. Go to you again. Let's see if that actually did it. Did not. Oh, oh God. Ah, 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 ah. <laughs> All right, he's got to be close to death. We still have haste. I think we're gonna get hit by this if I don't dodge. Ooh! Damn, right in front? Ah. Oh shit, almost got poked in the butt right there. Insta kill. Oh, defense though. Okay, defense. Big ass spider. More like a bitch ass spider. Walked right into that. Yeah, I did walk right into that. Excuse me?
be raised just to be safe. What is that? Is it lowering my HP? Hold on a sec. I'm confused. Fuck, I'm confused. I'm stuck here. Shit. I have a pre-raise on. So it should be okay. Uh or a medicine four. I just wore off, okay. does this fucker have? Oh! Can't avoid that. <laughs> I'm fucked. He confused me right in front of him. This piece of shit. Uh, I'm gonna have to take the hit. I think I have a pre-raise on, so... Might be okay? Right hitting him twice. What? Did he do any damage to us? Bro, I'll take it. Alright, cool, 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 cool. That should be pre raise Yeah, that's pre-raise. No, it's not. Wow! Are you serious, bro? Insta grab me off of that? That's fucked up. Can't avoid that. Let's go! With 36 HP, suck my fucking dick, bitch ass spider. You probably not even give me that much XP either. 20, 20k. That's it? Fucking bitch ass. Cocksucker. Yeah! Use barrier to absorb one hit, including the unavoidable attack. But doesn't that bring me down to 0 PE though? The 0 PE. Would suck. Fucking did it. Oh my god. That was a little nerve wracking right there. Use every single shit that we had. Let me see if I can remember this. I'm gonna check right. See what the hell is right. Put a save right here, real quick. Oh, look. Look at that. The storage closet. God, that was some clapping, man. Four boxes. B armor? I need to take some stats off of that. 96R. Ooh, triple command.
Nice. Nice. Son of Beach. You did it. Clapped him. We got clapped too, but I mean, we clapped him. So it worked out. Oh my God, look at all this stuff we got on here, bro. Good loot for sure. Definitely got the triple. We got triple commands. We probably we can't even see what it looks like. Because we got to go down one floor. Check right and see if there's anything else Ex extra. Any of these won't pop up. I guess wait to the elevator. Definitely not that way. Yeah, I save stated. I most definitely save stated right after that. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna do it again when we get to the elevator. Yeah, the stat anti. Let me see. I was going to see what it is first. Two super tools. Poison. Decrease attack power. Nope. And resist stiffness. Did any resist uh, confuse? I might save this just to check my other armor to see if I have any armor that resists confuse. I could put that on. Definitely would have needed it for that fight, because that shit fucked us up twice. We got hit by shit that we shouldn't have gotten hit by. But it's alright, we clapped him. Alright, let's see. Where the hell is this elevator now? Is it... The left? Yes, it is. B armor might be better. Let's check. We got two super tools, which we can use to transfer stuff over if we need to. Get to a save point so I can look at this shit. Oh my god, that's so stressful. Actually, let me look at it now. Base 85, 86, 45. I don't think the B armor is that good. Because, I mean, look at this. The base of this one is 102. The base of that one is 86. Oh, you're looking at the wrong side. It happens. The game, This game's UI is a little, is a little tricky. Yes. This song. Oh, God. Got two cards. Let me give this fool those two cards. Might be the last two.
Look at all these slots, my god. Yeah, I'll probably grind for more meds tomorrow. I think the I think the upper floors might actually give a lot more too. Eagle T card. No way. How much more can you do? Do the club. Hey, that's cool, McPhee. Toolkit. You can tune up your equipment as often as you want. No more need for regular tools. Let's fucking go. We got the toolkit, guys. Jesus. For all that shit. That is great. So super tools and regular tools are just useless now, right? Just regular, okay. We can just take the bonus stats from all these armors I'm not going to ever use. Focus on the armor first. Gonna see what has what. I'm gonna break up some other shit. Uh, I'm going to hold off on this one. Yeah, that's why you don't have to scroll as much in the storage. Yep, I'm going to break all this shit down now. Thank you, everybody, for watching tonight, man. Appreciate it. Been a blast. Absolute blast. The energy, too? Yep. Thank you. Thank you. Ooh. HP max doesn't stack back up, but... We try and recharge slower. Increase attack power. Let's do it.
Defense buffs, baby. Wasn't there a plus four item cap armor? Or did you drop that? Um, in a while. I don't know. This one doesn't give shit. AV jacket. All right, let's put all this back in. I'll decide tomorrow on if I want the auto stuff on there. Oh, this though. The equipment. Take all the stats from this shit. see the bonus stats on this shit. All along since the roach fight. What's up, Nori? Roach fight was... God, that was the first time my life felt threatened in this game. <laughs> I legit felt like I needed a doctor. That was... Put a name on the armor. Thank you. Oh yeah, what are these other ones I got? That doesn't seem like much. Knocked out, but you still came back, man. My dude. Bro, this shit is powerful. for that 300 attack. 
Yo, I was panicking for real, Nori. I was like, <laughs> Don't anally rape me, please. Don't do it. I'm just a wee lad. Oh, we got a lot left. We are the, you guys are the only fans. Hey. Making some beats right now. Well, jerk chicken right now. Why is that? Where is this jerk chicken I'm smelling? That's everything. No, I didn't want to add ice effects because fire and ice, uh, there's enemies that can resist them. Whereas the other ones I have on, they don't resist. So, fuck it. Breaking everything. Can't break the rockets, it looks like. Get this shit out of my sight. What am I at, 250 now? Yeah, we're at 252! I'm gonna one-shot all the mobs, hopefully. Up top, bullets are, yo, we got 56 bullets. Is that in a clip? Yo, that is wild. Insane. Yep, in a clip. Let me see what was in here. I remember I put some stuff in here early on. Look at that, so I got some extra shit we could break here. And a medicine three? Why the hell did I put a medicine three in there? Hey, come and clutch though. Just no nudes. I was almost out of storage space. I thought storage space in this was infinite. Oh, can you open his door down here? I wonder if you can open his now. So you like never can open this? I'm wondering. Bro, guys, we are ridiculously strong. Let me save a state right here before we actually save. One more thing. Yeah, we are close to finishing, but I'm not gonna do it right now. It's five o'clock in the morning. 
I'm gonna save it for the Friday stream. What we'll do on Friday is uh, we'll do, we'll finish up, get the ending of this, right? And then we'll jump straight into Parasite Eve 2. I think that'll be a great way to, to go about it. This way a lot of people will be, you know, here for that moment. Just to enjoy it. Enjoy it together. The warehouse key? Uh, maybe. Now, Gandis, make sure on the next stream, remind me to do that. I would definitely try to do that for sure. Oh my God. How much stronger did we get off of that? Oh my God, look at all this stuff. Yo, cyanide is insane. Cyanide's insane. First attack, crit, percentage, counterattack enemies. It's good. I mean, I haven't really seen it work. Yeah, I haven't seen counterattack work, which is weird, but not bad. <laughs> Three commands, clutch, acid effects, of course. I like it. And spray multiple targets. I wonder what's the final one I should add on to here. Can't think of anything. I mean, we already broke down all the weapons, so it doesn't make sense. It doesn't make a difference, but. Got your boy wondering. Oh my god. Guys. Thank you all so much. We still got seven floors left. My god, that took a lot. Like, we did. Yeah, we did 60. We did 60 floors today. And that. Look, how many hours was the stream? Nine hour stream. To go 60 floors. This goddamn game. My god. If I catch you while you're on last stream, you didn't show up while you were on or after for a few days. No way. Oh, shoot. Uh, no, Gandis, we'll be live Friday, 8 p.m. Eastern, but hit that notification bell. Hopefully, it will alert you to it. Uh, there's a certain. When you hit the notification bell, you got to hit all notifications so this way everything that we post will go live for you and you'll you'll see it but we are here no worry thank you you need about 400 plus attack for the final boss nathan no fucking way i mean we can get that easy you just gotta get one more level and i think uh yeah we just need i think we are like what 40k xp from leveling up and when we get one more level we're gonna get like 10,000 bp i can put that all into attack yeah, I stayed up super late. Which is weird. I checked to see if you were on your channel and it never showed up. Dog, it's, it's messed up. Now, Gandis, uh, the best way to see when we're going to go live, though, is our Discord. So uh, link our Discord real quick, chat, if you guys can. If you guys are in this live chat right now, please join our Discord. It's the best way to keep in touch with us and to see whenever we're going to go live, whenever I post videos, and also get updates on the giveaway that's going to be starting this week. Uh, this is actually on PC, Ali, Ma Ali Malik, but uh, I'm not playing on uh, Steam. I'm playing with EPSXE emulator. Thank you, McFever. I appreciate that. Yeah, guys, there you go. So be sure to join the Discord right there. Join our Discord. Trust me, you won't regret it. It's one of the best communities to be a part of. I got so many uh, things. Oh, God. Nice. I'm going to definitely look through all these messages, guys. Yeah, I see some people joined in. Wappity wap. <laughs> Foul Evo joined, it looks like. Yeah, you won't uh, be disappointed. Our Discord is amazing. Phenomenal. Oh, no, I just saw that. I, I love that song, Don't Matter To Me. It's uh, with Drake and Michael Jackson. It don't matter to me. It don't matter to me what you say. Love that song. Is Parasite Eve 2 a classic too? Uh, yeah, it, it is. It came out two years after this game came out, so it, it won't look too much different. There's going to be... There's a, there's a lot of things different about it, though. You might like it more. Uh, the cutscenes are crazy. There's a little bit more cutscenes from what I remember. Uh, Parasite Eve 2 is, uh, it's pretty wild. The combat is a little bit different, so it's going to be interesting to get back into that. Will I be playing Guilty Gear Strive? Yes! I love Arc System Works and their games. I'm really good at Dragon Ball Fighters, and I really want to get into Guilty Gear and see, uh, how much more I can enjoy it, because they have rollback netcode. You sent me something, Nori? Again? Let me see. 
I, I thought I checked it. You didn't hear me sing it just now? You, it doesn't, it don't matter to me what you say. That's uh, Drake and Michael Jackson. One thing I didn't like that Drake did was uh, when the fake allegations came out about Michael Jackson, Drake pulled that song from his tour. But after Michael Jackson was proven innocent for the fucking hundredth time, uh, Drake put it back on his tour. You didn't hear when I sang it, man? I sang it in the best voice that I could at 5 o'clock in the morning for you, man. Yeah. Well, guys, it's insanely late. By the time I fall asleep, it's probably going to be 6.30. <laughs> My time, Eastern. Uh, it's about an hour from now. So, with that being said, guys, I thank you guys so much. Each and every single one of you all. I am super thankful. I see Zay just joined the Discord. I'm going to add your uh, tier real quick, Zay. Got you, Zay. Make sure you guys join the Discord, man. Trust me. You guys definitely don't want to miss out on that. Who was it that was talking to me earlier about it? Nelgandas. Nelgandas. Make sure you join the Discord. That's the best way to keep in touch with us. You can. I'm on there all day. I'm very active in it, so you can ask me any questions. We have lots of threads, amazing group of people, and it's just a really fun atmosphere to be around. And we also will do movie nights again eventually. Thanks, Zay. I appreciate that. Well, till then, you guys, enjoy the rest of your night, morning, middle of your day, wherever you are. I'm going to go to bed uh, <laughs> very early. Got to open says you're in Australia. Hey, no worries, man. We got lots of people in here from Australia. Uh, right to name a few, uh, Mike, Mike Toth, who's in the chat all the time. He's from he's in Australia. We got a lot of other individuals that are from Aussie as well. Yeah, there it is. I see Mike's still awake. Mike's been here since the beginning. Nice. With the VPN. I got NordVPN. I have a NordVPN sponsorship. So uh, if you ever want to help your boy out, be sure to click the link in my description to join our affiliate and help me out with the NordVPN stuff. Appreciate that, guys. Oh, you just don't have your service set no worries man just join whenever you get a chance i mean there'll be all all, all lots of uh opportunities oh that's what you're using too no way yeah i got a nord discount for 68 percent off of two years like 68 dollars i think no 88 dollars or maybe less i can't remember but other than that if you don't want to pay for the two-year plan you can get whatever plan it is you want as long as you use my uh affiliate link oh man we are getting off now man we just got we got insanely overpowered so the next episode on episode f on friday we're gonna finish up the chrysler tower chrysler building we're gonna finish up the chrysler building in the next uh stream and then after we do that we will start parasite eve 2 so we'll see the final ending for this how it transitions into it and then we'll start parasite eve 2 right away that's what we're gonna do on friday pc master race 75% off uh, for three years. Yeah, they got rid of the three-year plan as soon as I got the, uh, like the month before they had the three-year, the 75% off for three years. But when I uh, got, a, when I got sponsored by them, it changed up. So it's all, it's all good. No worries. Thank you so much, everybody for hanging out. What a super late. What I think of the Monster Hunter trailer. I didn't see it yet, but it's late. I'm going to get off. <laughs> You guys have a great night, man. Thank you so much, everybody, for dropping in and hanging out with us super late. It's a nine-hour stream. We haven't done a, done one this long in a long time. I had a lot of fun. Looking forward to uh, seeing you guys again on Friday. You guys enjoy the rest of your day tomorrow, night, wherever you are. And uh, stay safe, you and your family. Thank you, Mike. You have a great night, man. Nelgandis, Ali, Nori, Renee, Omen, McFever. Thank you guys so much. You guys have a great night. Everybody else, souls too cold. Zay, thank you for joining Discord. Neji, of course. All of you guys, enjoy the rest of your night. I'm super thankful. Insanity King, what's up, my dude? Make sure you tune in next time, Insanity King, and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss when we go live on Friday to finish up Parasite Eve's new game plus. Price we're building, and then we're going to start Parasite Eve 2 also on Friday. It's going to be a fun night. So hit that uh, subscribe button if you haven't, Insanity King. I'm not sure. See you soon for the Parasite E finale. Yo, Zay, thank you so much, man. I'll see you guys in a little bit. Gustavo, have a great night and morning wherever you are. 
Till then, my name is Blitz. Thanks for watching, guys. I am out. Tired as fuck. It was a great one, though. I enjoyed it with you guys. Later.